Yo, what is up? Welcome, welcome back. Yeah, I know. I've been in my... I'm back. I, I, you know, sometimes you just need a little time. Chilling. Vibing. Uh, we've been playing Escape from Tarkov off stream. I've been trying to get fucking whatever that game is through, like, uh, learning how to play it. It's... I don't know how they do it, but they do it. It's definitely not my cup of tea, but we're, we're getting used to it a little bit. We're getting better at it. I got some kills earlier. We're going to play some High on Life today. We're going to try to finish this game tonight is my goal. I don't know how long it is. I don't know how, like, I, I remember it being like 10 hours, 10, 12 hours. So I, from what, uh, what I've been told, so, uh, or what I've looked up and stuff. So we're going to try to, you know, you like it. I, uh, we'll see. Let's see, it's, it's too early to tell. It's too early to tell, right? Like, I gotta get more time in the game. I gotta get more time. I do like this game, though, so we're gonna play this. Yo, Bias, Jed, Nick, appreciate the love. Let's get it. Uh, I don't remember exactly where we were. I think we had to, we had that uh, lady call, the news lady or whatever, and we were going to... Um, we are going to her world through the teleporter. If I'm not mistaken, we're going through this teleporter right now, and we have to go talk to her. Magistrate. That's what it was. The magistrate. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. It wasn't really our idea, oh, but it's a hey. guy. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Uh, no. We're Gatlians. Unless you're talking about my personal chauffeur. Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces, but perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? Yeah, I'm sure the big hotshot politician wants blood on his hands. That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug I will drag. trade. I I'm not going to so sleep, brother. And only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply. He's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you... You've taken out two top G3 officers and less damn time right. it takes and us to take down the rest as well. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Oh yeah? And how's that? This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until okay. the G3 are dealt with. Damn, I got kind of used to playing on my uh PC. What's the catch? Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. Yeah, no shit, like we're gonna stop now. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you What's to up, turn Dylan? to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. Yeah, yeah, whatever. We just like killing freaks. If you want to help, you're more than welcome. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you What's like. Up, Gabe? The view is breathtaking. All right. So we just got a device essentially to save humans. What the fuck? Is that oh, a teenage uh, mutant ninja feel turtle? Free to stay as long as you'd like. Shut the fuck up. Quit talking to me. You think eventually he'll tell me to leave? Because I just stay here? God, that's creepy. Let me get the fuck out of here. All right, we're back. So, it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yeah, not only that, he gave us a way to save humans. God damn, you got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. 
Hey, uh, speaking of, we should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you, you might want to hit up Bordeaux's chef stand, too. It's right. a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. Okay, so we can get warp discs and we can grab the jetpack. I gotta remember how to play, so... Power slide! Okay, remember the power slide. Bye, customer. You got some new items in the pawn shop. That's where we're heading right now. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, the pawn shop's up this way. It's been a couple days since I played, like a week or so, so we're gonna have to remember here. I think I remember most of the buttons. It's all pretty simple, so. Hey, you got any uh, jetpacks in stock? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Ah, uh, jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Okay, great. So where where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days, I promise. No refunds, by the way. This purchase is final. Fuck! God damn it. Okay, well let's let's just give Gene the update. Okay. Oh, you bought something. I guess you think you're a hot shot now. Wait, was there anything else I could buy here? We have that stuff for the disc, but Did I think the discs are... Yeah, shut the fuck up. I just want to see. I think I can get some upgrades here as well. Um, wait, this is for her, right? Oh, we get another gun later, that means, right? Ooh, bless me. All right, I kind of want to get... like uh, I like... What's up, boy? What's up, Sarah? Let's see what we got. We reload this organ transplant shortens Sweezy's internal firing track so we can reload faster. What is this? Uh, you know, let's, see, let's see another ammo sack to hold a few more crystals. This way the crystals never need to stop. Oh, I'm gonna miss that. It's not a mod, it was just a, an upgrade, right? Okay. Oh, sure. Nice going. You really know how to spot a good deal, partner. Have a nice day. Yo, Sarah, think about the thousand bomb. What's this? I can't believe my eyes. I must be dreaming. Yeah, Wake up, Jack. This is not some perfectly legal business. Appreciate that love. Perfectly legal business, for sure. Hi, bounty hunter. For sure. Movie theater. Ah, I like where your head's at. Boom. We're gonna fucking destroy this game tonight. I can feel it. Okay. All right. I don't know what the fuck that was, but that happened. Yo, what's up, Will? All right, so we just gotta go j give Gene the data on the, uh, the warp. No, the jetpack. Let him know that we can't get it yet. It's on back order right now, so. How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Kind of. That cheapskate, Mr. Keeps making us wait till he gets it in stock. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? When he's right, he's right. Let's get a cat nap in. Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm what really glad we met. Fuck? No, I, I think, I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry. I'm, I, I, I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up. L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to. Let's get you to sleep. Gl Glubs Day. The fuck is this? Lorb's Day, Tuesday, Wibs Day. Swib's Day. What the fuck? Oh, this is our jetpack. Alright, partner. Let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Holy shit, this rules! Oh, check out that landing! Goddamn! Oh, space friends. Thanks for watching. Hey, uh, my name is Thomas Snitchel, and I just want to say I didn't 
kidnap whoops baby the trial uh maybe let's time. try that again there. like nobody saw it i i was i was pronounced innocent but nobody really saw it so i i i'm i'm, I'm buying these commercials to just make sure everyone knows i did not kidnap the alien baby I Fuck! okay that's not gonna work uh, not creepy at all was, dude this it was, game uh, is a confirmed creep fest. in the court of alien law Damn, you're just like a TonyHawk.com jetpack bro. You know, sometimes it's nice to just fly around. Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You can fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. Wait, I can't remember how to grapple shit. Fuck. Not that button. Oh yeah, it's that button. I couldn't remember how to grapple shit. We'll get this. We're remembering as we go. Dude, what the fuck? Why can I not reach that? Oh, maybe I gotta jetpack that. Maybe I gotta jetpack it. So I, maybe I gotta... Okay, that didn't work. Ah, okay, okay. I think we're good. I, do some I gotta learn to mix all business. this stuff. So if I just... Okay, that doesn't work. Oh. Trying to learn what I can do movement-wise. you to clean up! This place is a mess! I need you to clean it up before Tweet gets here! Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck! Jean, like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fucked more aliens than your brain can comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot, though, right? Uh. Sure. I, I don't. On. I don't know. You haven't even seen him. Why'd you answer that? Trust me. You don't have to support her just because she's family. This guy's a loser. He is so hot. He's like a low seven or a high six. And he's a really low seven nice or to a me. high yeah, six. Yeah, no ulterior motives there. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. It's great. Dude, I mean, it's not you're wrong. lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending I mean, it's not than wrong. it is sweet. What? No, uh, look, we've spent all this time living together. I, I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. We're all living under the same roof, and that makes us family. And it makes her business my business. I'm the man of the house, so she needs to do what I say. And before anyone accuses me of being a misogynist, yeah, I know I'm a misogynist. We all know I'm a misogynist. That's bad, and I'm working on it. But this is about me being right and your sister being wrong. Listen to yourself. I can make my own decisions. I don't know why you think you're suddenly some father figure to me just because you're crashing on my couch and eating my diary. Oh yeah, I said eating. He's been eating pages out of my diary. So what? My species eats paper. It's delicious. Who gives a shit? I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Tweet to think shit? I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady Grimble job. Grimble Dick. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off. Just grow up and get used to me and Tweet. Come on, tell Gene I can date whoever I want. 
I mean, she can. She can date whoever Thank she wants. Thank you. She's a Not woman. that I needed your approval. Oh, fine. Yeah. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't know you were depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. Just clean up, Jean. Okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Clug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. Alright, two new bounties, baby. Let's get it. The Scrindel Bros. Fuck it, we'll just do the Scrindel. Gary fell in love and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down. <laughs> broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. <laughs> Dispatch 146. We have a 1052 double VOA call at the Dickinson Farm. I'm repeating. Dispatch 146. We have a double VOA 1052 call at the Dickinson Farm. Huh? I'm too tired for this shit. I can't chat. I'll fucking fall asleep. I, I'll fucking... It'll be movie time and we'll just fucking pass out, dude, if I do that shit. I already know. That thing's gonna be like an hour long and we're just gonna fucking get roped in. And then and then he's gonna... T he's gonna what's gonna happen is he's gonna turn the fucking TV off 25 minutes in after we get invested and I can't deal with that shit again, alright? I can't deal with that shit again, chat. I'm too tired for this shit. I've been up all day playing Tarkov. We're just now getting stream going. A moplet. It's you, the savior. Oh shit. Exactly. Yep. Now tell us stuff. Oh, uh, it was awful. Everyone else got enslaved again, if you can believe it. Honestly, I think they like being enslaved. Don't really care. But just to be polite, where are they? They're working at Scrindle Labs now. Just past the Mushroom Valley here. Just be careful. That place is freaky. Cool. Again, don't really care. <laughs> Playing Tarka but didn't stream it? Yeah. Uh, I'll stream it next time if I play it for that long, Jed. I, I was just kind of getting the hang of it, dude. It was, it was tough, bro. It was tough. I mean, it would have just been me dying a lot and not really, like, getting any progress done. But I, I've gotten a little better now, so I'd feel a little bit better streaming it. It's hard, too, because we're playing with so many people, man. Like, uh, I mean, a lot of it, a lot of times, like, when we're playing with that many people, dude, it's just, it, there's no action, right? Like, it's, you know, like, one person will get all the action, and, like, uh, everybody else will just be looting, you know, so. Uh, I, if I play, if I play with less people, I'll definitely stream it. But if it's going to be five of us again, four, four or five of us, I may not. Or I may just, you know, play separate from them guys and just be in the Discord with them and play. And maybe, and maybe just do some duos and stuff with uh, somebody else that's in there. Uh, if Donkey doesn't get on, like, Don't or something. you have a scanner? Okay, that's the way we're supposed to go. Yeah, let's just fuck it. Let's just go this way. Oh, wait, actually, there's a box up here. Let's go grab that. It looks like we're back in the... Oh, we are. We are. We're back in the area again, aren't we? Enough sightseeing. Do you even know where you're going? I'm not trying to just get lost in the jungle all day, you know. Shut I want to kill some Screndel. Okay, so this is where we've already been before. Um, if I do this, is it going to put this? Where is it going to put this? Is that that? Let me see what this is real quick. team kills and shit yeah it, it was definitely interesting plus you know i gotta i gotta test the waters with some of the dudes you know like they may not you know some of them may be not good for for the stream and stuff like that so but they were all really cool guys man uh you know i, I definitely could see them being you know okay to okay to stream with and stuff like that i know a lot of them are but some of them are new guys that i've never met before you know i have to be careful with what they say and stuff as a uh, as a streamer i have to be you know on top of, you know, making sure that... I haven't done Shoreline yet. Shoreline's one of the few maps I haven't done, Jed. Um, I actually, my last uh, round of the day, uh, early, right before I got on stream, 
Uh, I went in. I went into a factory uh, at nighttime. Couldn't see shit, bro. Met a really nice guy. A movie, huh? We've earned it. Let's take a seat. Here we go. It's starting. Met a really nice guy, uh, uh, and he helped me get out. But when he got to the exit, today. somebody oh, tried to kill us. He killed him. He looted it, gave me a pistol with a light on it. Then we went very, to the exit, and he got shot at. He actually got shot and died, and I got out alone. So I yeah, met some really, yeah, I met a really okay, nice sure. guy in my solos yeah, as well. I haven't bought the alien income, no, Brian. Are you sure it's not an unrelated wind? Oh my goodness gracious! Uh, my grandfather went the exact same way. Oh, they got burnt down across in 1931. It was a lot more common back then, right? Uh, Factory has been my favorite so far. I haven't made it there yet, guys. Stop all those lawn crucifixions. I like the shotgun, Jed. Guys, chill about the fucking alien gum. Should we watch this movie? No, I, why are we here? We came to play the game. Get the fuck out of the movie theater. Okay, what are yeah, we doing? I'm done with this. Movie we haven't watched? I, I've seen the film. All right. Why the fuck? I can. There, what I the can fuck are we doing, bro? Earth movies are dumb as hell. What the fuck are we doing in the movie theater? All right, where are we going? Holy fuck! Let's get this shit on the road. We get so distracted in this game. All right, let's go. No distractions today. We're getting shit done. All right. Up, Mel. You gonna jetpack across this or what? Shut the fuck up, dude. See, we just got we just getting started. Nice, you crossed a big gap. You want me to order you a trophy off of Delarmo Prime? Yeah. Good. Just... This is the right path. If it isn't, I'll freak out. Living vicariously through you right now, bro. I'm barely living, so I, me we living for multiple you, people could be tough, hunter. bro. What the fuck is talking to me? 
Sweezy's out, fuckers! Where the fuck are you shooting me? Oh. All right. Hey. No this shot, shit is bro. Close your mouth and plug up your asshole. It fucking order. kicked me off, dude. Ashley, appreciate all the like, guys. Sorry if I missed any of them. Once again, like, actually been up all day. Just watching my buddy streaming this and an alien he was shooting at just uh, stopped shooting and starts humping a dead body. It was super creepy. Have you seen anything? I haven't yet, Sarah. Uh, I know to expect it now, though, at least. This game is fucking wild. Like, every turn, I've just been like, I, I don't even know what the fuck to say. And I love Rick and Morty, but this shit gets fucking wild. Incoming! This shit gets fucking crazy. Fucking little freaks! Maybe you didn't like me or something. You good, bounty hunter? Fuck you, bounty hunter. You called and I picked up. Almost fucking died. Holy shit. Just so you know, things are going pretty well with me and Puig. I don't give a fuck. It's totally weird for you that your sister is dating alien, but I need you to get over it. You know, I just, I literally do not give a fuck. It's the exact opposite of weird. I just do not fucking care. What the fuck is that? DNA showing that those are living creatures. We already knew they were living creatures, though, and that we are just fucking murdering. Oh, that turns those off. Nice. So wait, can I turn those on and off? Oh, I can. Interesting. Wait, is there any point in turning those off, though? I don't think there is, right? Moving on. I, I don't think there's any purpose uh, currently. They're going this way. Wait, was that a oh, shit. I didn't see this chest. How the fuck do I get in there? All right, enough of this. We're, we're opening the door ourselves. This 
got to be a way to get in there, right? Fuck, dude. This is like the second one I or I haven't, like, I've seen and just can't figure out how to get to. I mean, there's got to be a way to open that door, I would assume. Maybe I get it later. Ready, bounty hunter? Oh, hold on. Three, four. Okay, so it says something about locks on these. Maybe I have to put all the screens on like a lock. You know what I'm saying, chat? Like maybe, maybe all the screens have to go on some kind of lock. Oh, we should check out the lock locks. Boom. Boom. Easy. Yeah, like sometimes I'm just a fucking master, you know? I'm just the best gamer in the world, dude. And other times I'm I don't know. I don't know. Other times I just don't know. Oh shit, that locked too, so I would have been able to go oh yeah, never mind, we're good. Oops. Don't forget, you know, you, you can use those to launch yourself. Okay, there's a box up there, so we want to go up there first. So we're gonna turn it this way. So we're gonna turn it this way, and we're gonna go. All right. For a warp crystal. Um, is there anything else we need to grab? Nope. I mean, I guess we can launch ourselves over that way, right? Exactly, JD. Sometimes maybe good, sometimes maybe shit. Most of, most of the time shit, let's be honest. But we like to dream around here. I think I'll launch myself here. Boom. And then it wants me to go that way, so we're gonna go this way first. Oh, yo, what the fuck are you doing? I don't know what the fuck that. Whoa, no, no, no. Oh, uh, okay. Pretty easy when we're up close. I wasn't even fucking up close. I just gotta have pinpoint fucking accuracy on those guys. I don't think there's any benefit to coming over this way. Quickly, quickly, yeah. Oh, what the fuck is that? Homie's got a fucking laser beam. The water acid as big a nemesis as the cliff balls? I mean, yes and no, right? Depends, you know, I, I've fallen in quite a few times, but nothing like crazy, crazy. How many of these assholes do they have? We will find you, bounty hunter. Yeah, fuck drones. I mean, it's, you know, it's acid at the end of the day. I mean, it's, it's still like cliff boss, you know? It can still be tough. Surveil this! Uh, I do get like a second chance every time I hit the, uh, the acid though, like. And it doesn't actually kill me either. Cliff boss kills me. All right, Scrindle Labs, dead ahead. Seven slap. Yo, that's a bitch move by the game, dude. That's some fucking. That was some Dark Souls shit right there. They tried to fucking get me with it, but I get a jetpack in this game, so it's a little bit easier to avoid, right? Be 
beyond the stars too. I think I can get back up there. Oh shit. Oh shit, the game punked me. Oh fuck! Oh, Can we use that zip line to cross? Yeah, it's definitely a lot more forgiving. Fuck, man, I wish my eyes weren't as tired as they were. I gotta stay up today, though, Chai. I fucking. So, uh, you know, what, what do you my think Scranda Labs is, is like? I, I, I mean, my sleep schedule like, is I, terrible. I, I know a little bit. I mean, I, I, I heard a bit, so, so I kind of know. But I, I'm just making small talk right now. You know, I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to fill the dead air. It's really uncomfortable. I mean, don't get mad at me if what I'm saying isn't that interesting, because you know, I'm, I'm doing my best here. You know. What's up, Eric? Appreciate all the likes, uh, Jeremy, Kangaroo, uh, Dustin, Eric. Appreciate all the love, guys. You guys are fucking legends, mate. I don't think I can get through there yet. Look who just stepped up in the place. Oh, All right, looks like a classic figure out how to get the elevators working situation. Figure out how to get the elevators working, Whee! eh? I think that's our next goal as well. Oh wait, it says, what is this? Oh, it shows me the uh, mechanics here of what I'm looking at. That's that. So is there no way to open this then? So we gotta figure out how the elevator works. Hello, and welcome to Scranda Labs, only authorized. Oh, you're the bounty hunter who helped us out with all that paperwork and killed my boss, Krubus. <laughs> we really appreciated that. But sorry, I need to let the G3 know that you're here. Just my job. Nothing personal. You're uh, gonna set off the alarm. Yep, I'm gonna set off the alarm. We've got an intruder. G3 are coming for you. Sorry, it's my job. And I don't care about you. Huh. That's kind of shitty. Oh shit, here they come. You know, hey, at least the elevators are working now. Total dick move by the reception. I mean, she's just doing her job, man. She's just doing her job, homie. You can't really blame her.
ammo sack. I thought it was worth it. Let's glob it to Just crack an elbow. What's up, Kevin? I don't think I can make it back up to that. I think I gotta do a different one in order to do this. Maybe click this one. Come on out so I can shoot you. We can't let them into Someone else somewhere. Oh, there he is. Shit, okay, good, good job. All right, now let's take a look around this place. You know, let's see what kind of experiments they're doing here. Okay, well, that's unsettling. The fuck is that? There's those little al or those little like I don't even know what the fuck those things are. Okay, I'm feeling I'm supposed to talk to him. What the fuck is going on in there? I'm not sure I really want to. There's no way I can do anything with these. It looks like I'm gonna get like a, a new gun or something for that for some reason. Some kind of device, maybe. Alright, let's talk to this guy. Oh shit, what are you the running fuck with are they pissed doing off in dick there? Gun? Would you like to do the honors? We're going to try to show up those cocky nerds in the weapons lab by fusing this human with some other aliens. Just hit the button. Uh, no, you, you know, I, I don't think we're qualified to, to, to make that decision. Look, I can do it myself if you don't want to. I'm just trying to be nice. Wait, don't I have... Stop 
stop it. We're not killing this one. Uh, chat, left or right? This is a, this is a tough decision, all right? Left or right in the chat? All right, I'll be right back. You guys got to choose left or right, all right? I can't be I can't be held responsible for this decision. Left or right in the chat. I'm going to be right back. I'm going to go grab a water. Left or right in the chat. I can't I can't make this decision. There's gotta be something we can use in here. What's up, big bro? How you doing, brother? What's the difference between the options? I have no fucking idea. We need more details, Alpha. I don't have more details. That's why I just told you to fucking press left or say left or right. Right, right, left, right, right. It looks like we're going to right. We got a lot of right. The difference is the differences. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, it's we Oh shit. I'm like, I'm like, what the fuck? Why is this not working? It's because I was. I was using my mouse and keyboard. Yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna go right, chat. You guys chose right. Are you fucking kidding me? Hmm, that wasn't supposed to happen. They died. What the fuck are you doing? Well, why, why'd you press the button, bounty hunter? Nothing happened, chat. We didn't do anything. We had nothing to do with that, all right? We just carry on. This is our best human Fergal hybrid specimen. It may not be as cool as our subject in the weapons lab, but it's still rather beautiful, isn't it? We call it a fur man, or, or maybe a hurgle. I don't, we haven't decided yet. Why am I telling you all this? You know, to be honest, it's because you look cool and a little bit badass, to be frank. It looks like a Fergal sitting on a dead human. Who's the scientist here? Me or you, huh? I mean, he's not wrong, right? He is the scientist. I am not. This place is kind of fucked up, though. No, this one can live, okay? What am I missing? The Scrandle brothers are very smart, capable brothers. They're not messy or weird. They do important science here, trying to figure out if you can clone stuff and uh, make aliens have babies faster. So the better man than all of life in the universe. Okay, yeah. it is all weird. Wait, did this one open too? Oh, I didn't even notice. Shit going on here. He's not even really supposed to be here if you're not part of the team three, but you know, that's fine that you know that. Don't mess with any of the experiments or kill anyone. Especially not the Scramble Brothers. Thanks. Have a good day. Holy shit, what are they doing to them? Are, are, are they dead? These three are indeed. The lab is separated into three sectors, each run by one of the Scramble Brothers. 
I think it was the only thing we missed. I think it was the only thing we missed. I can't get in there yet. I think. I'm missing something. Are you human? Yeah, I'm human. My my main the main character is human. What the fuck am I missing, Jat? What the what the heck? I, they said explore the facility. We did this. But I don't think there was anything less left to explore, right? Wait, 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 what was that? Oh, here we go. Here's something else. I'm sorry if this was one of your friends, Bounty Hunter. I, I bet it was one of your best friends. That's what I just get this weird feeling, you know? I bet it was one of your best friends, no? Good, good shot on the recon. I always forget about the recon button, John. Oh, I can go I can go in there now. I, I got everything. Nice, okay. I gotta go this way though. Sheesh, whoever works here really needs to get their shit together. What a mess. Hello, Jonathan. It's Dr. Gurgula. I've been asked to send you some of my findings on the human genome. It's only a small portion, and I doubt you'll even be able to comprehend what you're looking at. But I promised Garmantua so I'd provide them. It's the same voice actor, Kevin. Don't contact me again. I like this gun. I'm busy. I don't trust this fucking gurgle a creep. Okay, so weapons lab is unlocked. I'm assuming that's this. Yep, okay. Those fuckers. These are Gatlians. Hey, dipshit! That Gatlian's alive! Did we just stick our hand in its butt? Creature. Creature. Oh, hey! You look nice! My name's Creature. The bad guys did experiments on me and fucked me up real bad in basically every way you can imagine. Holy shit, am I glad to see another Catlian alive in here. Uh, are there any others? Oh my god, yes! There's so many! Oh, but unless you've been alive, then no. These fucking g oh, let me move bastards. my Creature, we're taking on the cartel. You want it? Oh, no, no, no. They take good care of me. Holding me against my will, cutting me open. Move me to that side. Experiments on me. Okay, so you can you know see the what? gun. Say it out loud. I think they might actually be bad. I'm part of your team now. Hell yeah! Welcome aboard, a uh, creature. That 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 that's your name? I guess so. Oh hey, we're locked in. But that's fine. Don't freak out or anything. I can give birth to a bunch of little freaks, and they can disable the door lock. It's fine. What the fuck? Oh yeah! Ah, beautiful! Look how one of my little fuckers just saved us! Being a dad is the best feeling in the world. Then a few seconds later, when your mutant kid dies because it has a microscopic lifespan, that's not so good of a feeling, actually. But I'm numb to it. Oh yeah! That's one of my children! They die fast! Don't worry! It's easy to make more! And it feels good! God, I love them so much! They grow up so fast, then they die! It's pretty rough being a dad. Do not recommend it.
What the fuck? What the fuck, bro? I thought it couldn't get any worse. I'm not even gonna lie to you. After the poop, after the poop uh, warp thing last time, I thought this shit couldn't get any worse. be annoying but you could use me to get into the weapons crafting center hope that's not annoying to say or anything yo this shit is fucking wild bro ah who are these cute critters Wasn't there another place I could use this on before? I right, just continue. This shit's fucked, bro. I didn't think this shit could get any worse. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys, but it, it managed to. It found a fucking way. It said, hold my fucking beer, bro. There we go. Why haven't you been using me? The dream team back in action. Make him bleed. All right, we're in. How was that? Up, was look that up. Helpful? Okay, got it. Give me a second. A lot of tiny guys really fast? Give me a second to uh, to examine every possible outcome, all right? Ooh, good choice, bounty hunter. You fucking... You fucking backseat gamers. <laughs> Give me time, all right? It's gonna hurt getting a weapon grafted to my arm. You're gonna craft a galleon to my arm. I'm gonna and it's gonna fucking. be permanent. Is that right? Because I'm I'm obviously oh God, down to feet? do it. I'm just a little scared. Look, guys, I don't know why my my floor a little and dirty I'm today. All right, I'm not being able <laughs> to use my hand in the normal way. Can you do my? Right I don't know my floor, my feet were that dirty, bro. Right <laughs> you had at least eight seconds. Oh, you know what I'm thinking though, it's actually gonna be a problem because I I'm left-handed, so I I, I shoot with my left to, hand. To be so if fair, my right arm, I might not be able to shoot as well. This is bad. This is probably. Okay, to be fair, I did go me. outside. I did walk the dog barefoot today. I don't know if I want to go through with this this way. Uh, maybe, maybe I can just work the desk. Oh, I don't have to be a shooting guy, you know? I can just, I can just be the desk nah, guy. I, I, I let the dog out and I went out um, there and I walked can, with her for a little bit. And I was barefoot. Spell. I forgot. I, can, I know Excel. I can do Excel stuff. What's up, John? I know formulas in Excel. So let me just do that instead of grafting a, a weapon to my arm. It's gonna, cause I can see you did it earlier to, 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 to Jamie, and, and Jamie was screaming a lot when you did it. And you said it wouldn't hurt at all, but Cheeto you screamed so much, it like freaked me out a lot. So, okay, you know what? I can tell you, I need to do this. I gotta go through with this. I can tell you I'm judging me for for being a coward. And I said I would do it. I'm not gonna back down. I can do it. Let's uh, <laughs> let's let's get this Gatlin grafted to my arm. Ah, oh, fuck, this is gonna hurt. Uh, 
Oh shit. Carry red colored? Are they? <laughs> Yo, eat my fetuses! Eat my newborn babies! Because apparently that's what we fucking do in this game is we... We kill our alien babies... For... For victory. I don't know. I don't fucking know, bro. Yeah, you see Are my toes it? really red? My toes aren't red. Alright! Not red, it's just the camera, guys. It's just the camera, guys. Are we oh we gotta launch a baby up here? What the fuck? Can I don't know what you're what the fucking are you what the fuck in my toes or uh, or the game or both? Um, oh oh and if you keep piling my kids on top of a guy, they can do mind control shit. They can make a bad guy fight for us. Oh shit! That mind control thing doesn't last very long. Sorry about that. I keep yelling at my kids to make it last longer, but they're shitheads. They do not. Hey, Brian, how you doing? You think I'm gonna answer your questions? <laughs> I would so shoot you right now if I wasn't strapped to this operating table. <laughs> you game and toes now? What's up, Kenneth? Oh, welcome to the dark today, brother. We just fucking do what we want, you know? We got zero chill. Can I talk to the- Oh, wow. What the fuck? So why won't this guy talk to me? I guess we just leave, right? There's nothing else in here for us. I mean, they're living their best life, so let's let them live their best life. I like how all the humans don't even look like they just look like holograms. They don't even look like real fucking people inside of them. Wow. They usually put me in an airtight crate whenever they take me outside. I really liked it. Oh, I can help you with that little book bug hive. Shoot my little guys in there. Look at my little guy in there rustling up the hive. Isn't that cute? I'm so proud of him. Huh. This game is so fucking weird, bro. Hey, this is fun! You do this sort of stuff all the time, bounty hunter? Unfortunately, yes. We do. That mind control thing doesn't last very long. Sorry about that. I keep. Oh shit! That mind control thing doesn't last very long. Sorry about that. I keep yelling at my kids to make it last longer, but they're shitheads. They do not listen. Another wave, no problem. Fuck me, fuck me. I don't know how to. Okay, we're just gonna do this way. This way's quicker. Come and 
yo. This gets prepped and ready to go. True, Dustin. But yeah, just fucking weird Fire motherfuckers just enjoy Fire weird shit, Jacob. you know? We're motherfuckers enjoying weird shit, that's what we are. Go get fucked, shit. Another battle, another pile of dead fucking dumb G3 bodies. Listen, bounty hunter, you wanna maybe try using Clug's device to save those humans? Help us, please. Huh? Do you have a way to rescue these humans? I'm new, so I don't know everything yet. Wait, am I supposed to go that way? I thought it was like out here. I guess it's in there though. You think you can just come to hell in here and fuck with me? You know who I am? I'm Jonathan fucking Strendel, aka Da Hog. Oh, I never. Brother. Up yours! Oh, hey, Jonathan. I think we're gonna kill you. He's a fucking eyeball. Okay. Oh, ow, whoa. Hey, are you fucking with my brain? No, I just fucked him up, bro. What the fuck? What the fuck? Shoot your kid across rooms too, or just other people's? Just other people's rooms. Or, uh, I mean, kids. I mean, kids, not real. Oh, fuck. Wrong words. Words hard. Very difficult. What the fuck? <laughs> just other people's kids across rooms, you know what I'm saying? Yo, what's up, Mark? Uh. Yo, these things fuck, dude. That's all I can say. Oh, I was supposed to use these to get up. I beat this game? Nice. I have not. We are on our path to beating this game. Oh, portal door. Do you use those to go back to your home base and regroup? I never saved the humans. Weren't there humans to save back there and I just kind of skipped them? Oops. Oh, 
Well, can you quit asking everybody if they bought the cum? Jesus. The fuck, guys. The fuck is wrong with y'all? So there were no humans to save back here then, right? Oh, here they are. I bet all the humans are happy here. There's a doctor here giving free checkup. Got my first physical in years. The doctor didn't really understand the human body, so I don't think it helped at all. But hey, free checkup. The toilets here are just out in the open. No dividers. But honestly, we all got used to it real quick. Now it's a fun thing like, hey, Toby's taking a shit. Let's all watch. What the oh, fuck? So let me let me get this straight. You like it here? Yep. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's a lot better than being trapped in a cage. You? Oh yeah, same. I like it here a lot more. A lot more than being trapped in a cage. We get twelve full meals a day. None of us have the heart to tell them we don't need to eat that much. This place? I don't know. This place is cool. They gave us free air massages. Yeah, I keep telling them it's not really something that humans like, but they keep offering them, so I keep thanking them. So you're the one that's saving us all. I get it. I tried reserving the sex room, but the waiting list is really long and they only let one person in at a time. I don't think they know how we have sex. Alright, anyhow, moving on. Oh, power slide. What's the plan? I question everything said in this game. And I just need to learn just not to at this point. True, Milt. Actually truing. I'm back! Yeah, what's up again?
There's more of them! Ready for Sweezy? Oh, uh, what the fuck? Okay, I think I just sent these. these Creature, guys we need your talents. It's one of your things. That's Angela Screndel. Nice. Wanna kill him? Oh, fuck. The bounty hunter's here. Oh, Angela's leaving. I guess he's busy. Bye, Angela. Son, you look, you look so good, son. Son. Fuck, they're I'm getting tired of killing you, fucker. Oh, shit, this one what looks the a fuck?
I think I saw a chest over here that we need to grab. Actually, I, we grabbed that one. That may have been the one I, I saw, actually. I think it was that one. I think it was that one that we saw. And we grabbed that during that fight, so... All right. I think that was the only one we had to grab. Yeah, let's go into the toxic shit. What? There's no toxic shit here. What did I hit? What the fuck? I think this would be a uh, perfect game for my 13-year-old nephew. Nah, I think my uh, my five-year-old... Uh, I think my five-year-old uh, nephew would... Uh, what, do, what, what do we get? I think he would like it a little bit more, you know? I think he'd get every joke that's in it as well. I think it's the Hell perfect yeah. game for him. He's really into Pokemon right now, but I think this might... I think this might be it, you know. You feeling that breeze? Cause I sure am. Oh, I love it. I think this may have been the missing piece. What the fucking glitch just happened? I don't think I was supposed to end up up here, chat. I did a pretty good job even with the glitches of like not being able to see shit over here. I don't think you're supposed to be able to get up here like this though. Maybe though. Maybe since you get the jetpack, they kind of just rendered all this shit just so you could see it. They're trying to kill you? That shit was crazy. It fucking booted me straight. Look, look, yeah. <laughs> Definitely not supposed to be up here. <laughs> okay, alright. Now we're no one we're no we know we're not where we're supposed to be, so let's click this, see where we're supposed to be, and let's go back down. my kids they, they figured out a way to get me pregnant then bam i shot all these weird freaks right out of my ass i love them all god i love them so fucking much my fucked up little boys the people in charge here are mad because they're not human nobody really knows what species these things are but i love them anyway i mean how, how can i not how, how could a father not love his fucked up little alien spawn it's impossible let's save your people Hey, Stacy. Hey, Carla. Hey. They want us to bang, but she uh, used to be my boss. Yeah, I was supposed to fire her, and then we all got abducted by aliens. <laughs> anyway, yeah, we're not attracted to each other. I mean, she's cool, but not my type. She is my type, but she's not cool. We should rescue your friends. They're so cute. Okay, then. I know I managed to break every fucking game I play on accident. Like, I'm just playing the game and it just fucking does some weird shit. Hey, Brad! What do they got you watching today? Uh, I guess it's supposed to be porn, but it's like alien porn, so I, I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea what I'm watching. I mean, I was able to get off to it, like, after a while. Um, honestly, now I love it, though. Uh, not sure why they want me to jack off this much, but, you know, I'm happy to do it. Like, all the tentacles and the moving parts, it's, I don't know, there's something really endearing about it. Yeah, I, I like it a lot, actually. I mean, if, if I ever get out of here, I, I hope I can, like, bring this with me, at least. I mean, I, I don't even think I could go back to normal porn after this. Nice! Go on, have a good life!
Yeah, I think I'm supposed to go that way. Did he said that shit so nonchalantly, bro? Like, I don't even know. Yeah, okay, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to go in there, so... What's in here? Can't go in there. Okay, so I guess we go... We just need to go into that room, then. Fuck it. Fuck it! I don't know. Seems good to me. I think we saved all the humans of us all, so... Before the G3 fucked me up. Well, never mind. If I did, they're probably all dead right now, so it doesn't matter. Who gives a shit? Hey, everyone! Stop here! We got that murder to kill! Use a good Don't meal. Worry. I'm on a break. I just want to enjoy my lunch. Yeah, sorry we didn't have any food. I've got a perfectly nice time bubble just waiting. All right, enough bullshit. We can see you, Screndel. Let us in. No, you can't. Fuck off. Yeah, come closer. Why can't I not buy this shit? You would have bought something if we had food, wouldn't you? Be honest, you would have bought something. Hello again. All right. Fuck you. Fuck. Oh, sorry. We can stop chasing you if you'd like. Nice and loose. Fuck. Come right up, come right up, come right up. Come on back when your belly's full. You look like you need a bite to eat. Why is this still telling me I'm in a fight sequence, dude? Like, I want to buy that shit. That's right, you need old Kenny. Reminds me of the deep from that show called The Boys. Oh, I love The Boys, dude. Yeah, and deep fucking, uh... My disc is ready. Fucking the octopus is definitely a funny scene. Club shot's ready. Let's get Why don't we just solve this with 
Checkers and step. Let's do this shit. Ta. Dude, is there an enemy that I'm missing somewhere? Like, I don't understand. Like, I... I don't know if it's because I just walked too close to him or something. But my game is, like, not going out of combat mode. So I can't purchase these fucking upgrades over here. Did you forget about my time bubble? No, I didn't forget about your fucking time bubble. Hey, hey, you need something to eat, don't you? Come on, come over here. Disc bladder, health, and LeMay's launcher. I need this. Don't starve to death out there. I guess I can just come back and buy them later, I guess. It's not that big of a deal. Whatever, fuck you. Yeah, it's only because I'm chasing this guy, uh, probably. If you combo that shit, bro, like you fucking hit them hard as fuck, dude. They're like fucking roaches. Oh, that was creative. That nice work. Oh, I can go back now. Okay, it's finally done. It was because I was chasing that guy. It's just like dumb that I couldn't like uh, just buy that like at that moment while I was there. Okay, so how do I get back in there? Uh, I guess we go this way. Wait, can I go this way? I can, okay. You look hungry. You still on work? Oh. Hey there! We don't sell food. Yeah, I can it's now. It's very confusing. So it's 35 out of the zone. It helps loose and creature up a bit with a fully charged shot. He can launch up to three of his little guys at once. It's not really that necessary. Some bounty hunters don't want to die, and that totally makes sense if you're one of those ones with bounty hunters. Okay, so I think I'll just get this. Hey, heads up. And this. Uh, do not try to eat that, okay? It's not food. I don't really use that, though. I don't really need heads either up. one of these right you now. Yeah, we'll come back for See both ya. of those. Let's save our money for now. 
I think the one we got, the health was all we really needed. It's not just because we're in a cafeteria. I want to sell food. I love food. But the Screndles won't just give me a damn license. I didn't realize that other one was going to be that expensive. We don't sell so food, expensive. I want to reassure you. We have an A1 Good bounty hunter. That's another one. Mona Shrindle. So there's just a whole bunch of these guys. Okay. Oh, they're the Shrindle Bros. Okay, I see. Oh, we already know how to. Oh, fuck. This one. This part is fun. There's more? The fuck, dude? Yeah, that's right. We got a secret form. Let's see you try to take on all three of us, uh, uh, you know, when we're connected. Fuck! Yeah, whatever! Figure it out! Sweezy's ready for blood! Fuck, dude. How do I dodge that shit? Okay. Alright, I think I gotta get, like, a little bit of separation. Holy shit, that fucked me, bro. I fucked him up. Alright, I start back right here, though. We're good. Fuck yeah! Sweezy time! What, do you want to get hit? No, he was supposed to fucking be right there. Shit. Hey, how's it going? Okay, I think maybe I can knock him when he does that. Let's maybe hit him with the uh hit him with the the disc. This fucking tornado's hit so hard, man. Sweezy's always the right choice. Hey uh, did I ever tell you that you're literally my best friend? 
Okay, I cannot hit him when he's on a disc. Holy fuck, this is fucking me. Let him kill you. Come on, just let him go. Watch out! Do not let that hit us. Okay, he's, he's like one shot hey, now. Why like, are you even putting up a fight? You know you can't stop the Shrendo! If I could just hit him with that shit while he's there. Yeah, okay, boom, bam. They separated! There's, it's not over! What the fuck? Looks like you could use some help. Don't say anything. I actually right can't now. tank Don't that. <laughs> yeah, I agree, Justin. Uh, so the thing is, the thing is, I have to, I have to shoot the, um, I have to shoot this guy at him and hit him with this guy, because this guy will stop him from being able to do any of that shit. How's it going? Fuck yeah, time a fight. You know you can't stop the Squendo. Holy fuck. I'm gonna go do something. <laughs> I don't know about that, King. Remember, we are playing on the hardest difficulty, so I, it sometimes may be good. Sometimes, sometimes maybe good. Shit. Sometimes maybe shit. You, you know on. how it is. Fucking run! This is, uh, this is definitely the tougher of the fights so far. But I, now that I've learned it a little bit, it's not quite as bad. I just can't fucking dodge that shit very easy. They kick me up in the air and it makes it like really hard. Oh, 
<laughs> What's up? Ooh, you know I'm always game. Walk on top and shoot. Okay, I got one. How's it going? You and me, two freaks! Sorry, I don't know if you're yourself a freak, but I'm a freak for sure. If you want to go, feel free. Two of them. Power sliding. This is the last one now. It should be easy. How's it going? Damn, so it's tough. That one was kind of tough. I'm not gonna lie. That was that was definitely the tougher of the fights for sure, for sure, for sure. Good, delicious. Now let me dig into the last bro. Oh fuck yes, three in one sitting. Each one more visually better than the last. You know what? I don't see this often, but I'm fully sated right now. I actually need a rest. Nice, not bad, not bad. My turn. That was tougher <laughs> fight. Tougher <laughs> fight. Mantuous? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I know who you are, and I want you to know how fuck you made things for yourself. You were living in hell before you met the G3. You talking <laughs> shithead? Bounty hunter. I've got the two most important people in your life. And I'm going to kill them. <laughs> oh, but not right away. First, I'll make things miserable for them. They're going to suffer as much as you've made me suffer. Fuck you. I'm not going to ask you to stop. I doubt you'd listen. I'd just like to inform you that I'm going to make sure you die. And that it's going to hurt. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> Besides, you won't even be able to get to my new base on Earth without the proper coordinates. So just sit tight until I come to kill you myself. Like that was supposed to face us? True. That went pretty well, dipshit. You're getting good at this. Let's take it home for a well-earned break. My trick hole is feeling refreshed. Ah, you killed the Screndel brothers and freed us again. Thank you. Thank you. Are we fighting some guys or just hanging out? I'm down for whatever. Everyone else is too traumatized to talk right now. Sorry. We just keep getting captured. Oh, ah. okay, you're leaving. Oh, fucking you, little Why pieces of shit. Eyes, I must be dreaming. Wake up, hey, that counts on GG and a few extra. Just, yeah, I appreciate the 1200, uh, King. Thank you, thank you for the love, man. That was a tough fight. Like, uh, I don't think it was definitely 
Like, I don't think it's gonna be the toughest fight we do, but that one, the it was just so much shit to focus on, man. Obviously, you're not as good at bounty hunting as I used to be. And learning the the rotation on everything. To admit, you're doing pretty damn well. Turn in that bounty. Hey, yeah. I actually wanted to run something by you. How would you feel about me maybe fixing up my old bounty hunting ads? Maybe putting you in them to drum up business? I mean, my name will still be bigger than yours in the logo, but we'd be stupid not to capitalize on your growing reputation. Yo, you guys are fresh out of friendalos. Oh, is that her boyfriend? Oh, hey, I I'm Tweeg. I'm dating your sister. Uh, this fucking guy. Tweeg. You need to leave. Um, Lizzie says it's cool if I'm here. You're just gonna let this sack of shit eat all my friendalos and tongue kiss your sister? I'm the one who bought those fucking friendalos. And leave Tweeg alone. You know he has a barbed tongue and he's very sensitive about it. I can go. No, Tweeg. You're staying. Tell him he's staying. Look, he doesn't even love you. He's just after our house. It's our house. Exactly. Hey, Tweeg, you gotta be careful around Lizzie. She's just gonna hit it and quit it. Real what heartbreaker. The fuck, I dude. get out now while you're still in the green. And hey, you want a real lover? Talk to me. Don't you have a galaxy to fuck? Come on, tell him to leave. Thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, it's my house too. So I don't even know why I have to fight for this. I'm just so pissed at everyone. Aww. Not you, Twig. I love you, baby. Ah! Disgusting! Look at this! They're not even the same species! Do, do you know how many holes he has? And they're all really advanced level holes. You really gotta take my nephew instead. His holes are more your speed. Shut the hell up, Gene. I am sick of your shit. All you do is sit on our couch and mope about how sad your life is. You're a leech trying to eat all of our friendalos and use the only family I have left to relive your glory days. Hey! Your family's doing a great job. You know how hard it is to kill that many high-level bounties in such a short amount of time? I mean, it's not as fast as I could have done it, but, uh... I know they're doing a great job, and I'm proud of them. But I'm stuck here dealing with you all the time, and you're fucking pathetic! Tell him how pathetic he is. Yeah, no shit! I'm pathetic! That's my whole deal. I'm homeless and legless and probably riddled with mental illnesses, which I'd know for sure if I didn't think therapy was a fake idea. You don't need to rub it in. I'll rub it in all I want. You're like 80 years old. You can't take a little shit-talking from a teenage girl? Jesus, I'm not 80. I'm 230. And that's really young for my species. I just don't want your creep boyfriend to steal my couch. You can call it your couch when you start paying rent. Until then, no complaining about who lives here. Lives here? He's gonna live here? I mean, if you think we're ready, Tweeg. Oh, yeah, sure. Hey, shut up, Tweeg. This isn't about you. Why? Because you're worried you'll have to share a cushion? No! Because I... Because I'm concerned! You barely know this guy. And it's dangerous out there for humans. Oh, that's rich and condescending. I am not an idiot. I know what I'm doing. You're cool with Tweeg moving in, right? Good. Like I needed your approval anyway. This is a mistake. Ugh, that's enough of this. Tweeg, let's go to the park. To... <laughs> to, to kiss? <laughs> yeah. Anybody got a fucking problem? Why with do you that? laugh? Hold on, why do you fucking Sorry, laugh like that? Let's just get back said... to bounty hunting. Can't wait to show you those Bruh. new commercials. New commercials? Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down and broke his crown. Watch out, that's hey, my elbow! Come, come here, come. Oh, what's up? Hey. Yo, bounty hunter, come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. 
Kind of like tough to listen to two sisters. Yeah, the Berserker with the two sisters was fucking tough as hell, dude. That was definitely yeah, playing on uh, God of War like mode. Like that fight was fucking crazy hard, comparatively at least to uh, some other stuff. Definitely one of the harder fights I've been in. All right, settle down. You can't have that. Your pain of that. Can I let you say what it you? It looks like shit. Yeah, sure. Go a little higher. Can you, you can do all that? Tell it looks like shit. It's a shit sandwich. It's an objectively bad painting, certainly. But it's important to me, Jorb's family. I can't sell something he poured his heart and soul into, even if it absolutely sucks. You go on and have the best day of your life. Because tomorrow, it's going to be rock bottom again. A perfect fit for a little shit. Gotta war hard, will we? Over here right now. Sorry for yelling and calling you an asshole, but I need you to come over here right now and buy my illegal shit. What's that guy yelling about? Illegal stuff? I is he talking to us? All right, finally. It's been a hot second. Hi there. I wouldn't say hey, struggling. Jesus. My name's Stan. It's not and over. I that's not over. Right. I only struggled I in a couple spots. That's probably not what you wanted to hear when you walked over here. Did you say alien cum? You want it cum or what? Okay, so this is where you're talking about alien cum. Okay. Uh, you sell alien cum. Do we look like we want cum? How's business? I'm just surprised you can make a living selling alien cum. I wish I knew that earlier. I consider it policy not to ask my clients why they want the gallons and gallons of alien cum they buy from me. I figure the less questions I ask about what people are doing with all this alien cum, the better. So, are you bored or nay? Keep talking, I'm interested. I know it's gross, but calm down. My name is Stan, and I sell horrendous amounts of all sorts of alien cum, and we're just gonna have to live with that knowledge together now. I mean this sincerely. Do we look like the kind of people who want to buy alien cum? I'm really just trying to learn about myself. Sure. Look, I have absolutely no idea. I'm shocked to my core every time somebody buys literally truckloads of alien cum from me. But they do it all the time. There's no rhyme or reason to it. I've been completely unable to narrow it down to a set of demographics. Grannies, cops, movie stars, politicians, everybody likes my delicious alien cum. I've had every type of weirdo coming up here saying, I like 600 gallons of your absolute highest quality alien cum. And, and, and I say, does it matter which aliens the cum come from? And they say, no, sir, it truly does not. I just want some alien cum. No further details needed. So what, what's it going to be? You want some alien cum or not? Yes, we've heard enough. Give us the alien cum as much as you can. Whoa, look at you. You want some alien cum. I'm so glad you're interested. Look, you caught me on a good day. I'm doing a promo one time off of free alien cum. Take some on the house, and if you like it, just come back and get some more. Just tell all your friends about me. Say Stan has the absolute best alien cum I've ever seen, tasted, touched, whatever. I'm not sure if it's his or if he's getting it from some other alien, but I'm just such a huge fan of his work and what he's doing out there on the streets of Flam City selling alien cum to the community. Say all of that. I don't remember any of the shit he just said, so I'm not saying shit, but we have a gallon of alien cum now, chat. And just what we needed. What the doctor ordered. Oh, hey, hey. Uh, I know I look like I'm uh, one of those G3 guys, but I am not in the G3. I'm like one of the few people of my species who did not join the G3. I'm. We, we call ourselves Merkeloids or Merkelids or what? I, can, I literally can't remember the name of our species, but that's fine. I, it's not important. We're, we're literally cannon fodder. That's kind of what our species is. Everyone gets pressured into to joining the G3 and then they get killed. It sucks. And I don't want to be one of those one of those dead cannon fodder types. I want to live my life. I'm not going to be peer pressured into joining a criminal organization. No way. I'm going to go hang out here in Blim City. But guess what? 
people are a little racist towards me because of all all the other people in my species are working for an evil organization. So now I gotta deal with discrimination. If you can believe it, that sucks. It's not fun. Discrimination's not good. You heard it here first, folks. <laughs> Don't di discrimination sucks. Anyway, I'll talk to you later. Maybe I'll have more to say if you come back. Okay. Whoa, we don't have to shoot that. Personal space. Hey, watch where you're going. Bruh. Bruh. This game's fucking wild, bro. Alright, let's go to our next bounty. I think there's much more we can do right now. Dr. Giblets. All right, here's the skinny. You're all gonna need some major firepower if you really plan to take on Garmantuous. Our team already has four guns. Isn't that enough? I'm asking for real. I really don't know. Trust me, we need this. Klug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlian. Oh, another Gatlian. That's fantastic. That's right. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. Don't get mad at me for not knowing this, because remember, my brain's been scrambled. But how would we find him? We do it the old-fashioned way and ask around. Maybe we find out his coordinates and warp him in. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I don't know. I'm fucking tired, kid. Maybe you'll appreciate me more if you do my job. I haven't known you very long, Gene, but I respect you more than anyone else I've ever met in my life. All right. Skip the portal door and just head out into Blim. Oh, and before you go, you might need a little extra help. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. Bounty Hunter, it's me, Sudo, again. I'm still here. I've been here the whole time. Welcome to Detective Mode. I'm here to help you sleuth out all those really big, crazy mysteries. Detective Mode? Hey, what's the skinny on this giblets fella? All right, let's see. It looks like you're looking for a... Dr. John Giblets. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Oh, fantastic. Let me do a quick search for you. This will solve it immediately, and... No matches found. Oh, well, it's never that easy. Why don't you start by interrogating the locals? I guess I should have figured this thing would be useless. Dispatch 146. You have a 1052 double VOA call from Dickinson Farm. Wait, this is Blim residence. Condict a fool. Am I in Blim now or no? Okay, I'm in Blim now. This is Blim. Okay. I can't remember from last time what everything was called. Hey, we're asking you some questions. Do you know Dr. Giblets? What are you talking about? Hey there, it's me, Sudo. Looks like you're trying to interrogate a suspect. Let's ask them some questions. What? Why do you care? Well, if you must know, I ate 15 whole sandwiches. And yes, I regret it. I don't know why I ate that many. Do I look nervous? <laughs> oh, jeez, you're making me nervous with this interrogation. I'm really sorry. I don't know who that is. But <laughs> good luck, I guess. Hope you find them. Am I what? What is it with you and this Dr. Giblets guy? My name's Craig, and I'm really sick from eating a lot of sandwiches. Leave me alone. Woof, they didn't know anything. That was a real D-rank interrogation. Sorry. Oh well, maybe you could just find more people to interrogate. You'll get it next time. Stop right there, Slick. We're looking for Dr. Giblets. You're gonna help or what? Slick, what the fuck are you talking like that for? Oh, Jesus Christ, leave me alone. I don't know, and I don't give a shit. I'm busy. You need anything else, or can I fucking go? Quit the... The drug guys? No! I don't have any fucking ties to the evil drug conglomerate. I'm a normal person trying to live a normal life in the city. Why in the fuck would I have any ties to the G3? What's my whole deal? 
Like, who am I? What do I do? Well, my name's Jackie T. Pooperton, and what I do is tell you to fuck off! How you doing? Like, with your weird interrogation? Awful! Annoying! I wish you'd stop! Ooh, bummer, they were a tough cookie. But they were telling the truth according to my censors, so let's say that was a C-rank interrogation. Better luck next time, let's look for somebody else. Bounty Hunter, you look hungry. Let me help I you out. Regular, taking your pills. Oh, yeah! Oh, my God, you found the kid a drum, right? Is this for him? Can he have it? Yes, but only if he promises to make beautiful, life-changing music with it. Oh, thank you so much. He is so excited and grateful. He's not going to let you down. This was a good use of your time. Thank you so much. Oh, this music is so lovely. All right, then. Yo, bounty hunter, want to do some perfectly legal business? You look cool. Can we talk to you? Oh, uh, sure. Uh, what's this about, can I ask? Shh, hey, quiet. Don't say his name so loud. I can't help you, but Blordo can. Mention my name, Michael Taint. Then he'll talk. But no cracks about my name. Uh, yeah. Everyone knows about the G3. It's just, we shouldn't be talking about him in broad daylight like this, you know? Holy shit, wow. You, we actually got something we can use. Okay, woohoo. That was an A-rank interrogation. Good for you. Let's head over to Blurdo and mention Michael Taint. Hi, Blordo. We're looking for Dr. Giblets. Can you help? Whoa, 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 where'd you hear that name? You can't just go asking around town for a guy like that. Oh, did we do something wrong? Sorry, should we not ask about Dr. Giblets? I don't know. Why do you think I know anything about Dr. Giblets? I don't know nothing. Now buy something, I'll beat it, buster. Ah, oh, that piece of shit. I'm gonna kill him. <sighs> Look, if you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. The Hyperbong 6 Midnight launches tonight, but you should be able to get in by now. Just don't mention my name. I didn't say nothing. Now get out of here. If anyone sees me talking to you, I'm dead. Those are shit Understood, lyrics. sir. Yes, sir. Very shit lyrics. Wow, great sleuthing, detectives. That was an S-rank interrogation. They married to somebody who just blatantly I'm ready for whatever's clever. Oh, we're gonna go back to the slums. Hey, this is my favorite VIP. Hey, you don't have to wait through any of this funny business. You are allowed right in, my friend. Just find this high on life. Hey, you gotta pay so hell out of here. You're so cool if you could just give me like a hundred. Fuck. Oh, yeah, hey, hey, yeah. Uh, I get it. You don't want to talk to me. I'm the broken leg guy. Nobody wants to talk to the broken leg guy. You heard you were asking around for giblets. Well, the Torgs are with the G3 now. So it's back on the street. Jeez, that's how you killed all these guys already. Have come down here, but I'm glad you did. Oh, this is gonna be good. You know, I was gonna try to marry Nine Fork before you killed her. I must got one to break or something. Put him on my chest and stand me. Hey, can you go? Oh, 
Ooh, good choice, bounty hunter. Question, what's up, Austin? If, it, if it's about your um, zombified villager, yeah, I accidentally killed him. Are you feeling it? I'm feeling it. You'll have to get another one. <laughs> I was working on, uh, I was working on getting it where, like, all we did was have to put the zombified villager in there. And, uh, to get the witch to hit him with the thing. And, uh, I was setting it up and uh, the witch killed him on accident. What you got in mind? We have to get another one, brother. I had another one, but uh, he fell off the the thing when I was fucking with shit too. So I just haven't got us another one yet. Time bubbles. <laughs> I knew you were gonna say. ask that shit, bro. <laughs> I mean, I have no idea where he went, man. No idea, dude. Uh, he just vanished, bro. The G3 doesn't stand a chance. Yeah, I just I was playing dude and he just actually just vanished man. I, I don't know where he went dude. No fuck. I run out of juice. You joined the space program? Yeah. Fell into the void? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. But, um, essentially, I set it up. The way I have it set up, if you, uh... We can put the zombified villager in there, and now, like, the witch will hit him, like, automatically or whatever. At least, in theory, I have to keep working on it and, like, testing it, but... I was just trying to get it that way we could just turn them easy, but... Cause I, I kept dying trying to get her to use the potion of weakness. This yourself. It took so like uh, I finally got her to use the potion of weakness after the villager died. It still have like a 25% chance to throw it, but she would not throw it. Yeah, she threw everything but the potion of weakness at me though. It was fucking annoying as shit. Oh great, yeah, let's go into the toxic shit. It it does only target the player. Fuck, I, I got some on me. Yeah, the witch only targets player, but you can set yourself in a spot where uh, it'll hit the rock and it'll splash the um so essentially like what you what you want to do is you want to make her hit a rock every time. Below eight hearts is what it says, but I've seen it both ways. I think she just has a 25% chance, honestly, at this point. Fuck, I keep dying. Yeah, no. It doesn't matter though, but I, I don't want to talk about that right now, though. Like, uh, just, yeah, you, your villager died. Good luck. I, I was trying to set it up where we could get uh, a little bit easier of a uh, farm going for that, but it just didn't work out. I, I gave up last night. I think I just go over here. What is that for? Why is that one there? I think I just go here, right? Yeah. Why is that there then? That's completely pointless. I got faith in you, man. You ready, partner? No problem.
Sorry for saying Scorched Earth, I bet they... I wish they, like, I would actually talk in the messenger thing. Because I don't ever pay attention to that shit, to be honest. You know, look, the slums have always been a mess, but I, I don't like what they're doing over here to this place. It's, it just feels weird. Oh, shit! Got a heal? So dumb, I hate it. That's it for me. Another wave. What's going down? go we made it to high on life the fuck oh i just hope they don't make me buy a new adapter i guess this is it oh, thank god they opened this new high on life store so, I've Nikki, been counting down the days. For sure, I'll love guys. Thank you for the likes on the stream. Hey, don't worry. Detectives can always cut lines. The rules do not apply to the law. Nobody cut me, or I will scream. I can scream real, real, real loud. This is not screaming. Seven nine two three, your local Hyperbong Superstore. Please, no trampling of other patrons during the midnight launch. Well, well, well. I smell another mystery. I'm Pseudo, by the way. You know me. Hi, Pseudo. I'm a detective now. Yeah, you already know what I'm gonna say. Try interrogating all the employees here. Well, that's a great idea. You're an even better detective than me. Holy shit, this is a madhouse. Oh, 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 sorry. Hi, thanks for shopping at High on Life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? 
Oh, man, this again. L look, man, I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I I'm, I'm kind of a fuck-up. I lied on my resume. I got this manager gig. I never even met Dr. Giblets. I, I don't know what he Going looks good, like. John. I couldn't even point him out in a crowd. Slow down there, slick. You're saying you know Dr. Giblets? Yeah, yeah, sure I do. He owns this place. He never comes around, though. I don't really know where he is. What? I told you. I have no idea where he is. And you're being really aggressive. Leave me alone. It's super fucking busy right now, and you're distracting the hell out of me. Okay, shit. Not, not so good. It looks like we've uh, hit, a, hit a dead end. So let's get the fuck out of here and just give up on being detectives. It's all done now. Hello, and welcome to High on Life. How can High on Life help you today? Great question. Thanks so much for your interest. We sell Hyperbongs and Hyperbong accessories. The latest model, the Hyperbong 6, is even capable of smoking humans. That's right. That hot new species you've been hearing about, High on Life Hyperbongs, are the only way to get that fix. Illegal? No, 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 not, not in any real sense. You must be reading some of our detractors on the internet or watching too many Clug Nugman speeches. Hyperbongs are totally humane and of no harm to anybody except the creatures you smoke in them. Nice day for a shopping trip, ain't it? It sure is. I know I'd go shopping on a day like this. Except this wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. That's right. Seems like they're poking their beak where it don't belong. Be a shame if something happened to your beak as a result if you catch our drift. Just when things started to look all rosy, two knucklehead lungs showed up to hassle us. You got a fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Pardon my associate here. He's only got one good threat, but I assure you, he can back it up. That's right. A word to the wise. Stay out of this. Got it? We've got this covered. You get to meet a lot of cool, silly people when you're a detective. Sometimes they even do the same kind of voice as you. Everyone should be a detective. Be careful, I got a real up in those yes. animals. A body. This was classic mystery stuff. Except it seemed very obvious oh, this shit. guy was trampled to death. Uh, yeah. My friend Davy Glutes got trampled in the rush. Pretty sad, right? One moment he was there, next he's gone. Squashed. Oh, you can go ahead and take his bag boots. It's not a problem. He was really... Bag. Yeah, that's fine. You can totally take those mag boots. Detectives aren't perfect. Sometimes we steal property off a dead corpse. But we'll do whatever it takes to Hey, hey sick moves! You're making good use of those mag boots. You're using those things way better than David Glutes ever did. Look at you! Hey, Bill, you been doing any crimes? Let's fuck shit up! Why is there an apple? Well, you my this. All right. Yeah, essentially, Kevin. Well, I wouldn't. They get fucked up on humans, yeah. That's high on life where it comes from. They're literally getting high on life. In the most literal sense you can My think. My trick hole's ready for you. Let's glob them.
How's it been going so far? That's what that was for. Welcome back. We've got company. Hello there. You guys again? No worry, they're cool. We've been observing you. Hope that don't rustle your jimmies none. Because newsflash buckos, we're on your side. We'd like to formally apologize for how we treated you earlier. We didn't realize who we were dealing with. You'll have to forgive us. And we're sorry we still sound like we're intimidating you. It's the only way we know how to talk. Our wives hate us. We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Maybe you've heard of him. He's certainly heard of you. Here's the skinny slim. The Torg family, or what's left of it anyway. They got mixed up with a bad crowd. The G3 cartel. Or more specifically, Dr. John Giblet's PhD. And Clug wants it squashed pronto. He says you're the right bounty hunter for the job. Says you're already helping him. Says the G3 is our common enemy. We've got a lead on Dr. Giblet's. He's been whooping all over, leaving behind a nice little warp trail for us. We're thinking you can follow those breadcrumbs all the way to the gingerbread house. That way Clug don't have to get his cute little hands dirty. You dig? This kid's fast. Yeah, check out Dale Earnhardt Jr. over here. Let's say somebody dies. Maybe, hypothetically, their name is Dr. Giblets. Well, should anything like that happen, we had nothing to do with it. We didn't even mention it. This conversation How do they know who Dale Earnhardt Jr. is? And Clug as will aliens. be very grateful. Speaking of which, why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Huh, all right, let's, let's go talk to Clug. Oh, welcome back. Thank you so much for all your help. Yeah, they've been aces. Yeah, real pros. Hey, Clug. Sorry about those two. They can be a bit intense. Really, I don't know why they talk like that. But look, you've seriously done so much for me. I hate to ask for anything else, but this election is really close. And, well, keeping the G3 out of blim, it's really going to help me lock this in. Do you think you could, you know, deal with... Dr. Giblets? Well, yeah, no, I mean, we, we that's what we want to do, you know, but it's uh, just the trail went dead. A dead end? Oh, no, we can't have that. Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Not sure what might be on it. Oh, that's how we get to Dr. Giblets? Whoa, whoa, even if this map data did take you to Dr. Giblets, we're not 100% sure it would be his actual base. You'll still need to do some detective work. Fuck yeah. All right, then we just kick Fuck the door yeah. and thrust our way in there, find him, <laughs> grab him by the neck. Hey, hey, hey. Yo, that I was so good. I officially tell you to do that. Not if I want to win this next election, at least. <laughs> good luck out there, bounty hunter. Uh, Fuck we yeah. We will do our best. Fuck, dude, I need to make that a sound, a sound uh, bite, dude. That was fucking nasty. Get out of town. Who the fuck's the map data? 
made like a tree. In Find us that fucking Dr. Giblets piece of shit. What's up, Zach? Fuck yeah, that shit was fucking good. Go. Magistrate Clug came through. He pointed us right to Dr. Giblets. That's great. Help me. I kind of regret not voting for him. Ow, now get out me. there and kill Giblets. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Well, never again, because now we have the brand new this. Oh, 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 okay, oh, 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 well, oh, well, okay, well, now, well, now I sort of, now I can, now I can kind of see, and that's what you'll see when you buy this for yourself, and you can never have to deal with this. Oh, 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 okay, oh, oh, whoa, whoa, oh, hold on, wait a second, get out of here, hold, oh, oh, ever again. Hello, thank you for not changing the channel or walking away or anything. It means a lot to us here on Human TV. We want you to sit and watch all the human movies we air on here. As a reminder, my name is Humandor the Human, and my bosses will shoot me right between the eyes if viewership dips too low. So just stay put, sit right where you are, and keep watching for the love of God, please. Here's more Blood Harvest. Figured I would take a quick and commercial break. And came tumbling after. Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Gary fell down and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after. At night, when the mask is off, I look at myself. I may make the world think I'm happy, but I can't hide the truth for myself. Whatever happens, I must go on acting, acting, acting. Be a polyarch, oh, love. <laughs> Clown, love. Okay, Aunt Peg. I just thought maybe my mom and dad would be with you. Yes, I have tried everybody now. Well, All right, I commercial you breaks up, Jeff. This week. Okay, I'll try not to. Pretty sure that was like the other movie, but we ain't got time for that shit, alright? I got shit to be killing. What the fuck? in a sort of weird way over here. Next time, don't try the G3. We have to shoot the bounty hunter. Oh, hey, what's going on out here? Highway Village. Our currency here is tigers, and we sacrifice our young ones to Lord Asphaltia, High God of the Way. At first we were scared. How did we end up here? Where were we? Should we leave our highway? And it turns out the answers in order as I asked them were, I don't know, I don't know, and definitely not. It is true, we used to hate each other, honking and shouting, fuck you, back and forth, like animals, but now, we have found community and love. Hey, I'm the youngest one left alive. That means they're gonna sacrifice me to Lord Asphaltia tomorrow. I'm not too excited about it, to be honest, actually. Hey, I'm not even that much younger than everyone else. I'm 45 years old. I just happen to be the youngest by a couple of months. 
I know everyone's happy, but we did kill a lot of children in the name of a god we only made up within the last week. Isn't that crazy? Hello, friend. My old life was flawed. Now I live the way of the highway. Lord Asphaltia provides for us, by which I mean sometimes a mite scurries up into our territory. We eat it and it's so, so we don't die. They taste awful, but it helps us not die. You know, I didn't believe in Lord Asphaltia a few days ago, but I mean, since then we, we've made him up and I'm like, uh, I, I'm a believer for sure and for sure and forever, Lord Asphaltia. For sure and forever. Huh. guys. I'm dying! 
I'm dying. Okay, you, you... Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. Oh. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh. oh my God. What, what, what happened? G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well, it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. A G G3 base? Oh, my God. Uh, it was probably Dr. Giblets. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. Okay, hang in There's... there. Hang in there. We'll, we'll stay with you as long as it takes. No, no. It, it's my time to go. Oh, thank you for, for staying with me. You had to do it. You, you had to put him out of his misery. It was like a really annoying horse with a broken leg. You, you know? It, it, do you understand? Is there an equivalent to broken leg? You, you following here? It seemed like the right decision before the, before the game even asked me. I have a feeling the game was going to ask me to put him out, if I should put him out of his misery or not. I feel like we made the right choice. Also, this does not look Hello like a box. Again. Look who's back, baby. Let's get nasty. <laughs> should have given him more time. No, because they tend to just go on these long-ass tangents. <laughs> oh, like, I could sit there for 10 minutes and listen to it, or I can just make a quick decision and put it out of its misery before we have to listen to it. It's really, it's really my call, right? And to be fair, it normally doesn't let me shoot anything. So, like, when I click it, like it's like a trigger finger, you know? Sometimes you just click it. I know I wanted to hear it. Jesus. Okay, so by the game. Dr. Giblets's base. Entertain where, where the me, streamer well, man. Sure I entertained you by uh, shooting it early. A little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Jesus Christ. Okay, okay, fine. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation for everyone who died. But it's great for us detectives because we need a good mystery to solve. Someone was killing G3 Mercs. You know what? That makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. I mean, look at you. That's what you're doing. The fuck? Okay, I scanned that already. Oh, I have to scan this again. Hmm, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there. That's what they're used for. That's what drones are for. They're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Okay, so there should be one more thing I can scan in here. Wish I didn't sell my uh, PC so I should I could buy it. This, oh, I hate this. You get an angry rag. Wait. Looks like your typical work desk. Nothing too crazy. Uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Doctor Giblets while he was doing experiments. I don't know. I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. All right, then. Let's, let's keep moving. Howdy there, cowboys. Uh, oh, shit. Sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, howdy there, detectives. Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's got to be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. We got this, pseudo. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, I like All right, this. Here's my new theory. I like this Dr. guy. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know. Like These must be old hyperbong prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these out. Now we can move on to the next thing. You really want to shoot them? Come on, no you don't. Oh, 
All right, I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go go find more clues, baby. Ooh, boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do. So, okay, he was right. Not crazy. Normal guy. Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Jeez, it looks like Dr. Dibbles was pissed he didn't get first place in, in science. Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. Wait a minute, so you had us do all that shit for nothing? Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much, I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. The fuck, dude. In the end, Dr. Giblets took the easy way out. A little disappointing because I was looking forward to a fight. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me at him. What the fuck are you waiting for? The guy died, so let me carve him up already. Sometimes, life just hands you an easy break. There's no reason not to trust life when it does that. Ah, oh, don't tease me! I'm Jones and bring me close and let me knife him up! Status report, no life sense detected. Entering full security lockdown. Uh -oh. Hello! If you're hearing this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations, you killed me. But I knew this day would come and I was prepared for this moment. Now see if you can survive my retribution for beyond the grave! Another ambush! That's detective life for you. So many ambushes. Hey, idiot! Stop! Everyone calls me to kill you! But look at me now! I'm dead and you're trapped in here, fallen prey to my glorious science you're ever so jealous of! That's right, Primothy! I know you do. What? Be nervous? My lab? Or just a plain old space Oedipus complex? If you're still hearing 
this, you're taking a long time to fight this way. Don't be dead by now. It's okay to die. Yes, yes, I was wrong. How could I have been so blind? I know who killed me now. It was you, Krubus. What, what is, what? He, he thinks Krubus killed him? Yes. Jesus Christ, how many of these did he record? Hi there. Krubus, 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 always complaining about being the lowest rung on the G3 ladder. You thought you could kill me? Can't imagine. 
All that, for no reason. As I continue to study these humans, I find them to be more complex than I ever could have expected. Initially, I saw great potential in both the Fergals and the Gatlians. But now, I see how foolish I was. Those were nothing but dead ends. Humans, however, humans are going to change everything. God damn, what the fuck was the G3 doing with this guy? We should probably grab that Gatlian, you know? Is, is he even alive? You know what? Let's take him back to Gene. Gene knows. He can fix... get him all fixed up. say you know today, today really meant a lot to me and um uh god that's so fucking hard um 
Your free trial of detective mode is up. So see you later. Bye. Your free trial of detective mode. Oh, thank is... God. Okay, bounty hunter, you go through the menus. You find that detective mode. You shut it the fuck off. Never again. Okay, I'm serious. Delete it. J delete it. And if we, if you can't do it, we, we, we go, we go to, you know, we, it's a whole mission. It'll be a whole DLC mission. Every last peso. Wow, look at that. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See? It's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go. Come on over, let's bow wow. Uh, he thinks it's a problem that we're all so horny and having sex all the time. And it's not a problem. It's fine. Uh, we don't like being told that what we're doing is wrong. You know, old people, we get horny. It's just part of life. We're not going to stop having sex. We're not going to stop being horny. That, that's, all, that's my promise. Who does Clug think he is? But yeah, I've got wrinkly skin and I fuck all the time. I'm allowed. That's fine. Okay, uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead. My game but we also so bad. found another Gatlian. Oh shit. That's great. I I I I don't know about you that. You wouldn't I mean, notice he, that, Connor. He's not really functional. I don't I don't I don't, I don't think he's dead, but oh, God damn. Yeah. He's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Do you, do you think he's salvageable? Buddy, I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix it. Okay, th thanks, Gene. But you know, if, if you can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, nothing! I, 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 I was being shitty. You, you, you didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh... Turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. Okay, come on over. Let me give you the news. All right, what do you got for us, Gene? All right. Which do you want first? The good news or the bad news? Uh, ta. Okay. You want me to talk about something else? Like what? Shoes? Why? I, I have important information to share with you. I'm not just shooting the shit here for fun. Are you just trying to be annoying or mean? I mean, is this some kind of weird power move to try and teach me my place or something? Making me wait to tell you my important shit? Quit the head, look. I'm not playing along. Christ, kid. Good news or bad news? Make it quick. Hey, well, I lied, kid. I don't have any good news. I was hoping you'd just ask for the bad news, and then you'd be so upset you'd forget to ask about the good news. I was trying to pull a fast one on you, Jesus. and I failed. So, uh, it's pretty embarrassing. All right, here's the bad news. Lizzie's been gone for a while. It's probably nothing, and I'm obviously not actually worried or anything, because I, I hate her. But, uh, you know, you, you might want to look into it, since she's your sister and all. Maybe... Check with Tweeg. He works at that Space Applebee's uptown. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that's everything. I'll work on getting us some new bounty leads if you want to go look for Lizzie. And, uh, I'm going to see if I can fix up that busted Gatlian you saved. Jesus, that is a lot to take in, Gene. Hey, uh, Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlians here with Gene and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? You know, just you and me, uh, our favorite people, our favorite... Uh, you and I are best pals. Oh, sure, we can use a little break. It's nice to stretch out a bit, you know? Take a little nappy poo. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Change the channel, Gene, to porn. Have a good time, you two. We'll hold down the four. All right, bounty hunter, let's head to Applebee's and we're, let's find your sister. All right, guns. 
no funny business while the bounty hunter's away. Look at us, just you and me again, you know, just like old times, like the dream team, you know? Uh, so Applebee's, it's in the slums, which you, you know, you, you probably knew that, so your suit can point us in the right direction. So you take the lead, bounty hunter, you, you, you know, we'll talk with, you know, we'll, we'll, we're gonna, we're, we're gonna chat, it's gonna be good. It's gonna, it's all good. Don't worry about this. Don't get shooken up about the, I, don't, I, there's no reason to be, uh, you know, d Broken leg guy still here. See you later. Hey, listen, I'm sorry about being weird back there. It's just, well, oh, there's something I need to tell you. Whew, this is this is hard. Just give me a second. Oh, you got this, Kenny. Come on. What are you doing? You're making it awkward. Oh boy, okay, so that um, that dying Gatlian that we saved, let's do it. Let's say we can fix him up and, you know, back alive. The thing is, oh, okay, sorry, sorry. I I'm just trying to figure out how to say this properly or, or you know, like communicate um, how we normally do, right? You know, the Gatlian we saved, let's do it. Uh, he knows some things about me that, that, that the others don't know. And it's, a, it's nothing too crazy, you know, it's... It, it, you, Okay, no, it's, it's- I'm worried about your sister. You, you think Twig is working today? Dude, he keeps cutting himself off because I'm moving so quick. Welcome to Applebee's. Table for two, right this way. Uh, actually, I don't know what he was gonna say. I was wondering if someone named Twig is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to talk. Uh, yes. We, we, we will, we will take a table. Well, at least we get to go to Applebee's. Enjoy your meal. Your waiter will be with you shortly. Thank you. You can actually move? I didn't even think about that. Okay, listen, I I'm sorry for making us sit here at Applebee's. I know we're really focused on Lizzie, and that's kind of the important thing, but would you mind if I kind of got something off my chest here with you first? Right, look, yeah, I know you're worried about Liz. Wait, you're just hungry? Well, you know, we are at Space Applebee's. I mean, it's a problem solved, I guess. I guess, you know, just just order something, you know? I, I'm gonna, um, I, I'm gonna tell you my whole deal, if, if that's cool, while, while you chomp. Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? Nice. It got taken over by the G3, like yours. You know, all my people got enslaved. You, you, you remember that, right? You know all that, right? Sorry, of course you do. Well, um, what if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? Uh, okay, I, I can see you're at a loss for words. I, I, I know how it sounds. I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm going to be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started with one of our signature cocktails? Uh, not, not now, please. We're, we're kind of busy here. Okay, sure thing. I'm gonna go ahead and get that in for you. Uh, thank you. Okay, bounty hunter. So l l let me explain. Gatlas was isolated on the far edge of an asteroid belt. We were completely untouched by the greater interstellar civilization, j just like your planet. But you know, I, I wanted out. Like I wanted to see the galaxy. I wanted to see what everything out there had to offer. That's when Rel Del Mar crashed his ship into our planet. He was this crazy smuggler. He, he'd been all over and he'd seen it all. And, 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 and after I helped him fix his ship, he wanted me to be a part of his crew, you know? And he, he took me with him. And I'm back. Here we go. This is for you. All right, now what were you thinking for an appetizer? Uh, so I'm sorry. We're in the middle of something, please. Great, it's coming right up. Oh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but wh where were we? Okay, oh, right, um, obviously a guy like Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers, and, well, you know, that led us to the G3, and Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower, and, well, looking back, you know, I see how stupid I was, you know, I, I really do, but at the time, I couldn't tell, you know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. No, everyone thought I was a fuck up. You know, I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something, you know? Open up. Here comes the appetizer.
Treasure Train. Chicka, 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 choo, choo. Thank you. I ho hope you like those. Now you better be ready to order that main course. You betcha. I'm going to get that order right to the cook. Okay, thank you. So, I led the G3 right to Gatlas. Do you see where I'm going with this? We fought them off at first, you know? But they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. You know, a few of us were immune. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Let's Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived, and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now, about how I left Gatlas to pal around with a criminal, how I led Garmantuous and the G3 right to our planet, how I got everyone killed, except Let's Do It survived. Somehow, the G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. God, if we can really bring him back, do, do, do you see my problem, right? Like, I, I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did, to, you know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Emotional thing. Uh, you know, this is important baggage shit we're dealing with here. Take a hint and get out of here for a second. Uh-oh, -uh, someone's feeling grumpy. Oh, wonderful. Now, wh what the fuck is happening outside? Lizzie? Don't follow us. Twig and I are in love, and we're going to travel the galaxy in his space RV. Uh, actually, this is moving kind of fast. Not Help me, please. Not finish that sentence, we're in okay, love. we gotta get to them. Do not finish that sentence, we're in love. Yo, what about my food? What about my food? Oh, shit, yeah. We, I can't dine and dash. I love this place. Don't want to get blacklisted. Wait, could I have left without paying? I'm a good person. I immediately saw the check and oh, what the? Oh fuck! fuck? Okay, th this this changes shit. This is bad. I'm here live in downtown Bloom City, where, as you can see, we've been invaded by violent and agitated G3 cartel forces. No one can say for sure why they're here. We're here to kill you, bounty hunter. <laughs> It looks like this is only a problem if you are that bounty hunter that they're trying to kill. I'm People Fuckerton, Blend City News. Stay safe out there.
Okay, I think we got everything we need here. Can I use this to catapult myself? Damn. Hey, what are you doing? We, we gotta get to the house! Okay, so I don't think I, I think I just literally just skipped through this shit because it's a lot of enemies and I only have the one gun. So, and he was telling me not to fight everything, right? So I think we just try to skip through this. This is a lot of fucking enemies. I'm fucking tired. Child. Holy shit, dude! My sleep schedule is fuck. I've been sleeping like 4 p.m. to one like 1 a.m. right now. It's fucking weird as fuck. All right, so let's try to skip all this shit. We're gonna try to. Oh shit. Would you stop fucking around? Gene could be in danger. I can't believe I'm saying that. Keep Broken up the pace. Still here. See you later. We have to get back to the house. That's right. Let's go. We're going to hurry. Oh, yeah. I've been here the whole time. But don't worry. I'll keep your secret safe. I'm, I'm not a snitch. Yeah, that is true. Knifey, knife, was, uh, knife was there the whole time. Hey, I was talking about that shit. Hey, just so you know, man. I was, like, really scared. Fucking trouble. Oh, shit. They're fucking everywhere. Get to the house. Come on. We got to get to the fucking house. Surprise to see me. Bounty Hunter? <laughs> you fuck with the wrong crime syndicate. It's all over. Hand over the Gatlians you stole from us, and then let me kill you nice and easy. We know we know everything about you, and we still have two oh-so-special people who are very worried about you. <laughs> Turn yourself in, and nobody has to get hurt. But we'll deal with that later. Please fire up the warp core. We're leaving. Got it. Hey, don't forget about us. Oh, sure. Yeah, take in the sights. What's the plan? Yeah, the warp's ready, but can we go with the G3 won't follow? I'll handle that. Can you pull off the Hennison maneuver mid warp to juke them? Can I, what? Do you make that up? You mean scramble the warp? Fine, yes, yeah, scramble the warp. Bounty hunter, bring me to the warp core. close i may be 230 but i don't want to die yet are we D did did we make it yeah we're safe nobody on our tail but uh where are we am i missing something i'm not picking up any signs of life out there then we're in the right spot kenny where did you just take us it was the only safe place i could think of careful it's toxic out there i set up an atmos bubble so you can breathe so don't wander too far or do what does it matter anymore? 
Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? Pretty soon Earth is gonna look like this too. We have got to stop the G3, bitch. Sorry, nobody answered me. I asked if this was our home. Anyone? How is it out there? We, we, we don't want to talk about it. That bad, huh? Well, uh, don't get all depressed about it. We still got more guys out there to kill. Let's powwow real quick. No, Brian. <laughs> the fuck, bro? Look, I hate to be pushy, but are you ready for your next bounty? What is you know this? what, kid? 2001, bro? Rest. Let's save the bounty hunting for tomorrow. Head on upstairs. I'll take care of things down here. I hate to say it, but Gene's right. Hey, Let's get some shut eye. You? We'll make this right starting tomorrow. You must really be into vampire hookers, huh? Okay, why didn't you tell me you had the All sick? Right, good night. This fucked up human movie, don't you? We only said one day this time. Last time we said like three or four days. All right, you're finally up. Okay, let's get back to it, I guess, you know? I, I, I hope Gene has a lead on Lizzie. Let's go. Yeah, look who finally decided to wake up. You know how late it is? Because I don't. There's no sun on this dead rock of a planet. By the way, I got you a little something-something. A new suit upgrade. Extra overshield. You're welcome. Let's get to business. I've got something you like. You can breathe easy. I'll get right to it. I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. I'm so happy! She is alive, right? She's alive. Don't worry. But she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. If you're ready, just step through the portal door. I don't know what I want. Okay, fine, I don't know either. Isn't the sex good? I don't know. I can't even tell if we're doing it right. We're aliens. None of our shit even lines up correctly. You could be pregnant and I would fucking wonder how that happened. My cum goes all over outside of your body. Well, okay. I don't know if it's good either. Your body is really confusing. God, I'm just so confused. Aren't we in love? You're asking me that, dude. You're the one who dragged me out on this trip. I wasn't looking for anything serious. I just wanted to get laid. But even that turned out to be some weird fucking Hellraiser puzzle. Oh, shut up. Don't blame this on me. There's plenty of ways you could have figured out how to use my equipment, so to speak. Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, yeah, thank God. You came just in time to save me. Me is who you came to save. Thank you. Fuck your sister, dude. Woo! Cuckoo! Girls, am I right? Love is tough. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I don't know. We were a little worried about you. God, everyone needs to chill out. When have you smoked? What, you're a smoker now? Wait, what is it? Camels? Marble? 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 Marbleos? Marble? Marble? Marbleos? Marbleos? I don't know. I what don't know either. Do? <laughs> I fucking want? hate that word. Wait, what? Well, hold on. Maybe I'm not happy. I mean, how do you know I'm happy? How does anyone know they're happy? How does a person know they're happy? Am I happy? She's not happy. Fuck, man. Don't listen to him. I am very 
very fucking happy. Twig and I are going to figure out how to bang all night long with our weird incompatible bodies, and then we're going to be even happier. I mean, that would be sick. Just don't go yet. Just <laughs> hold on. I don't know. What are you thinking? Oh, yeah? How? Oh my god, just choose. Yeah, how about you just let me handle this on my own? You already decided to become a weird alien killing expert. Don't strain yourself trying to be a dating expert, too. Um, yeah, no offense, but you're kind of butting in, dweeb. Hey, only I can talk to them that way. And look, I'm sorry I dragged you out here. Really, I am. I know you didn't want to. But I just, I wanted to know for sure if, if we worked or not. Oh, yeah, it's cool. I forgive you. I just think, oh, oh, really? Even after forcing you to leave with me? Yeah, okay, it's fine, yeah. Did you know I almost sold you out to the G3? They were offering, like, a lot of pesos to find out where you were. And that would have been way worse. What the fuck, Twig? You piece of shit! Wait, what? Y you're joking, right? No, I really almost did it. Like, I had my phone out and everything. If Lizzie hadn't dragged me on this trip, I probably would have. I'm not good. I'm a shithead. Lizzie shouldn't be dating me. Gene was right. And it's a little fucked up because he was being a misogynist, but he was actually right. I do suck, and I'm fine with it. That's just who I am, and I love it. So fuck off. Love it. Sue me if you don't like it, but good luck finding a judge who'll take that case or a lawyer. Fuck it. You're a fucking idiot. Well, Jesus, I was about to do a, a whole thing about how we should take a step back and slow things down, but you know what? Fuck you, Tweak. Yeah, d yeah, Tweak. Fuck you. Hey, thanks for coming to get me. Seriously, it, it means a lot. Uh, okay, enough. Let's go. You got it. Smell you later, Tweak. Hey, you guys are welcome back whenever you want to come back. If it, I mean, fucking five minutes from now you can come back. I don't give a shit. I'm lonely. We're not coming back, idiot! <laughs> fucking tweed, bro. We're back. You're safe! Uh, I mean, fuck you. And fuck you, too. Okay, happy reunion. Everyone's fine. Can, can we just get back to bounty hunting? Yeah, 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 yeah. Club just sent over the data on Nipulon, so you can head out while I fix Les to it. Did you, uh, know how much firepower this guy's packing? He's gotta be at least ten times as powerful as any of you other Gatlians. Wait, you really think you're gonna be able to fix him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have them all patched up by the time you get back. Y you're serious? That, that, that soon? Yeah. Don't worry about it, kid. Your friend's gonna be just fine. Old Papa Gene watched a bunch of GooTube tutorials, and now he knows his way around cybernetics. That's, that's, that's great. It's, it's just... What? You don't sound too happy. You know how hard I've been working to save this guy? Fuck. Whew, okay. I guess it's now or never, Bounty Hunter. Can you set the other guns down on the table for me, real quick? Hey, everybody. I, I... I need to come clean about, uh, well, sh phew, this is f way tougher than I thought. Spit it out! Yeah, spit it out! No, I I, I can't. I, y y you're gonna hate me. Dad, th we, we don't have secrets. We're a family! Well, hold on. I might decide to hate him. It's okay, <laughs> Kenny. You can tell us. Oh, just fucking say it. Okay, fine. Y if you don't hear it from me, you're just gonna hear it from Les Dewitt when he wakes up. Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason the G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'll be mad. I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... Fuck, he's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. Kenny, how? That doesn't even make sense. How can it be your fault? I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But, but how could that be possible? 
We didn't even have interstellar travel on Gatlas yet. I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and I was going nowhere, and, and, and he took me with him on these adventures, and it was supposed to be, you know, this fun, awesome thing, and but then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. It all happened so fast, I, I thought they killed Les Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. I didn't know he I didn't know he was gonna survive. You mean you didn't think you'd ever have to tell us the truth? No, 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 that's not it. I, I... Oh, This is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See? I'm not the biggest fuck up here. Not now, dude. Everyone, please. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. Let's just... Oh, okay, let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Sure, easy, done. What's next on the agenda? Forgive Garmantuous too? Come on, th th that's not fair. Don't fight. I'm sure we can all figure this out. No, creature. He can't just drop that bomb on us and expect everything to be the same. I, I'm sorry. Look, I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. Nippulon may not stay where he is for long, so I know things aren't... The ideal, but, uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy, you don't mean that. Enough! Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. You're professionals! You're bounty hunters! Act like it! Mm-hmm. Fine. <laughs> okay, yeah. Gather everyone up. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Terrine. So we gotta strike now. Can you handle that? Let's just get this over with. I guess that really puts things into perspective. Hey, thanks again, and good luck. Stay safe out there. Okay, we just need to sneak into Nipulon's lounge. Let's try... Can it, traitor! We'll handle this one! We don't want you selling us out. Kenny, do us all a favor and sit this one out. Hey, stop fighting! I hate it when everyone's fighting! We need to talk things over in a healthy way. No, 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 no! We just need to cover ourselves in goop again. It's not complicated. That's true, we should do that. But I also think we need to have a really fun time at the saloon, so go there first, please. Ah, uh, whatever. It's it's up to you, Bounty Hunter. Head over to Drake Town and get gooped up, or try hashing this out at the saloon. To the saloon. I think we go to the saloon here, chat. Ugh, don't they know how bad I feel about this whole Gatlas thing? I know they can hear me right now. I know that's sort of the rule, rules we set up, but still, don't they know? Oh, you're going with my plan? It's an honor. I will not take this lightly. Shall we take a seat at an open table? This was your big idea. What is there to even talk about? Thank you everyone for coming today to the inaugural Big Friendship Meeting. First item on the agenda is... You don't have to do this, creature. No, no, I insist. Kenny doesn't deserve any of this hate, right, Bounty Hunter? Well, thank you, but I, I don't I don't know if that's true. Yeah, you didn't know what you were doing. Just because he's an idiot doesn't mean he gets off scot-free. Yeah, people died. We don't have a home anymore. No, no, stop it! I mean, let's be civil here. We're friends. Are we? 
Most of my friends don't trigger global genocides. Well, I don't know if that's the best way to phrase it. Oh, yeah? How would you phrase it then? Lightly assisting a global genocide? I didn't know. I, I didn't know what would happen. Oh, fuck off. Like, that makes it any better. But he's also trying to stop it. He's trying to make things right. We all are. It's not, not like he has much choice. You think he's doing this because it's the right thing to do, Bounty Hunter? What? Then why am I doing it? I asked you for help, Bounty Hunter. You just feel a little guilty, don't you? Of course I feel guilty. I'm, I'm not proud of what I did. Good, you shouldn't be. Creature, this isn't getting us anywhere. No, it's going perfectly. It has to be going perfectly, otherwise I'll be sad. Then be sad, Creature. Tough shit. You could just blame Kenny if you want, like we're doing. It's pretty easy. Can we just bail on this little group therapy session we got going on here and get back to the bounty, which is more important? Honestly, I'm right there with you. you know, th th this, is, this is a lost cause. No, it's not a lost cause. Is it, Bounty Hunter? Yes, we will. Yeah, look, look, fine. Maybe. Maybe. But let's just deal with Nippalon first, okay? Can we do that? Whatever. Are we done here? Can we go, Bounty Hunter? Sorry about that. I just wanted to help. That was such a waste of time. <laughs> I thought that'd be so much uh, more uh, fruitful than it was. Can you get us the goop guy? guy? Oh, no can do, partner. See, my little gooper trooper here is sick as can be. Looks like he's not gonna make it. Truth be told, I don't think I'll ever be gooping anybody ever again. Unless we get him that medicine. Medicine? Oh, no! That's so sad! That's breaking me up inside. We'll help out however we can. Oh, no way! Thank you so much! Wow, that's so nice of you. There's a special flower over there on uh, the other side of Terrine Ravine. But good luck getting over there, because that ravine is tearing through the valley, if you know what I mean. Those damn mac and cheese brothers are taking forever to build the bridge. I mean, if you could get them to do their jobs, then maybe we could get the flower and save my little Goopa. I think we can make that happen. No promises, but we do a lot of the really ones I killed crazy already, stuff is it? like all the time, and it's usually fine. Well, shit. I don't want to give my hopes up, but thank you so much. Wanna see my Kenny impression? Huh? Um, um, can, can, can you stop by the G3 headquarters real quick so so I can sell out all my Gosh, friends? Kenny's still our friend. No, it's fine. Let him go nuts. Wait, I can do one too. Oh, uh, nobody loves me and I suck. Uh, I'm a piece of shit. A big dumb sicko who loves getting everyone killed. Here's mine. Well, my name's Kenny. Uh, oh, I'm sorry for what I did. I, I love you all very much, and I'll, I'll never do anything bad again, ever. Tragedy. Great work, Me everybody. Too, Marky. Me too. You know, they... Hey, 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 whoa, whoa, Buster. What are you doing walking on... Okay, so you're not leaving, are you? You're just fucking barging in. What do you want from us? We want to cross. Let us cross. Well, tough luck. You, you, you think you own the world? You want to get across the ravine? You got to wait for us mac and cheese brothers, brothers, to do our work. Yeah. Yep. Ah, oh, that's a shame. There's really nothing we can do? No, sorry, pal. Listen... We got our own emotional shit right now. You know, we're, we're on strike until Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers, you know, he comes back from that goddamn saloon in Old Town and he tells us he loves us Mac and Cheese Brothers, his sons. Oh, uh, I'm sure he does. All right, listen, we just need to hear that he loves us. That's it. We ain't working until we find out, okay? Hey, we're the Mac and Cheese Brothers. Yeah, you can't do shit. You're... you're... Friends, we're looking for Papa Mac and Cheese. Hey, do you know Papa Mac and Cheese? Watch yourself. Don't want to go get yourself in trouble. Hey, do you know Papa Mac and Cheese? Hey, 
You there? Yeah? I'll tell you what Papa Mac and Cheese is. If you do this guy. What? No, not me. Please pick anybody but me, please. What, huh? A duel? Oh, okay, well, you know what? Listen, whatever. We'll do it. You know the rules. Stand five feet apart, count to three, then draw. Last man standing wins the fucking duel. Come on, man. I, I don't want to do this. Come on, it'll be fucking fun. Go on, then. Get to your mark. Perfect. Here we go, then. Jeez. I'll count you down. Shoot at each other on fucking draw, all right? Great. All right, we got this. Two. I believe in you. I think. One. Fucking draw. Oh, that's some quick trigger finger you got there, fuckface. Oh, appreciate that. Did, did we kill the guy, though? Is the guy dead? Oh, yeah, he's dead, but it's fine. We hated him. He's a fucking piece of shit. Anyway, sorry about all that. I was just fucking with you. It's fun to do a whole Big Ten shootout thing, you know? Yeah, we love it. Anyway, I'm Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers. What can I do you for? We talk to your children. Oh, is that so? Yeah. And how are those good-for-nothing pieces of shit doing? They love you very much and want to hear you say it back. But I hate them. They're shit heels. They ain't fit for the Mac and Cheese Brothers' name. Wait, are you... What? Are, you, you don't really want us to tell them that. Yeah. Tell them I said I hate them, and I hope they all fucking die. Now leave me the fuck alone. Uh, okay. I guess that's that then. You are... You're a tough guy, Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers. Hey! I'm not changing my mind. Seriously, you gotta fucking leave now. Maron, I'm done talking to you. You're getting the silent treatment from now on. Oh, power slide! Oh, look who's back. Hey, so what, what, what did Papa say, huh? D does he love us or not? Listen, I'm sorry, but he 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 wouldn't say that he he loves you. He he wouldn't say it. Oh fuck him! God, of course, typical piece of shit asshole, deadbeat dad. You know what? We don't need him. We never did. You gave us the power to love ourselves. Actually, no, no, fuck that. It's not true. I'm lying. We we need our dad. We need a papa. We need him so bad. I love my dad so much. Even if he hates me, I love him with all my heart. I'm bleeding over, overflowing with love, and I don't care who knows it. It's it, it's a curse to keep loving him, such a shitty, heartless father. But I'm I'm, I'm, I'm I'm bursting with love. I'm bursting with love. Oh my god! Oh, I'm like a fucking bomb yeah. exploding with love for my papa. Oh, I'm like a fucking bomb. What is it? Oh my god! What is going on? What is that thing appearing? Holy shit! Is that from the love that's happening? Oh my god! Holy shit! I'm like a fucking. I'm like ejaculating. If if you know what that means. Jesus, these guys need therapy. <gasps> But hey, it looks like we can cross now, though. What the fuck, dude? Oh, wow. Power slide! Alright, we did it! Let's get this back to the goop salesman and fix up his gooper. Oh, this game gets weirder and fucking weirder. Ooh, think of all the work ah, we could have saved, you know? Oh, fucking bridge of love, fucking made a bridge of love. Oh, yeah. Oh, we oh, did see it. You, see you later. Oh, I fucking figured it out. Oh. 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 You're not kidding me. You're telling me. Really nice to see you again, partner. You been hiding from me? Hey there, fella. You're not from around here, are you? <laughs> I guess that sounds like kind of a cliche thing to say, doesn't it? But no, I'm genuinely asking. My name's Cake Mittens. Well, not really. Everyone calls me Cake Mittens because one time I got real drunk and... Hey, Fat Finger Floaty's my name! And Trungle Funk's my game! Oh, yeah, no, I, we, we, we don't know what the fuck Trungle Funk is. Oh, you look confused. But I can tell you want to hear my sweet flute tunes. Am I right or am I right? Park your rears and clean your ears. It's Trungle Funk p Flute Time. Okay, you know what? I, I'll admit it. This is good. This is good.
Most species is really alcohol resistant, so I just buy so much more alcohol just to get even the slightest buzz. Sometimes I'll just pay for three kegs right off the bat, and if I'm lucky, I can drink them fast enough. Sorry if I'm a little distracted. I, I, I've, I've got what a lot on my mind. You know, like all my friends blaming me for genocide. Oh, whoa! All right, heads up, warp base. You did it! This will save my little Goopa's life! Thank you so much! It was no problem. But actually, no, it was it was really tough. Uh, but you're welcome, you know? Uh, yeah. Okay! Oh my god! As good as new! You really saved his life! I don't know how I could ever repay you! Oh, that's right! He could shit his Goopa all over you! Wow, you healed him up so nice, his goop's gonna last even longer than before! So you're gonna be covered in shit for such a long time! That's great! Ugh, all this fucking work just to get covered in this shit again. Wow, you look great! Real goofy, real shitty. Real goofy, real shitty. Oh, fuck. Damn it, now we're covered, so we didn't have to fight oh, this! Yeah. I forgot, I forgot, I forgot! Fuck, I forgot! Oh, shit! I'm a shoe salesman! I forgot I don't have to fight. <laughs> oh, fuck me, bro. God, I need sleep, but I gotta stay up, chat. My game crashed. Hold on. My game actually crashed. Wow, GG's. Pause. I just, I fucking saw a yellow and I just started shooting, dude. Actually, this might be a good place to, to fucking stop because I, dude, I am so fucking tired, dude. I don't even know why. Damn, we didn't even stream four hours, chat. Fuck, dude. Like, this is where I got. Okay. Yeah, we can start from the uh, the goop, and then we'll finish it next time. I think it's a good place to stop, chat. I, I'm just so fucking tired for no reason. I gotta I gotta fix my fucking sleep schedule, man. I don't know how I'm gonna fix this shit though. It's already busted as fuck, dude. Holy shit, chat. Holy fuck, man. I dude, I like. I haven't even been up 24 hours, and my fucking eyes are so tired. They're so fucking tired, chat. Holy shit. What happened? Well, my game crashed, but uh, I'm just tired, Kevin. I'm just fucking tired, man. Uh, my sleep schedule has been fucking terrible. I've been, um, I've been staying up, like, or been waking up at, like, fucking one, and I don't want to stream at one, so I just get up and I, I chill, and then before I know it, it's, like, fucking 12, and I'm like, well, shit, I don't want to, I don't want to stream midday, and I don't know, it's just been weird, man. It's just been... It's just been fucking weird, dude. I just need to I just need to start getting on stream whenever I'm playing, dude. And just say fuck it. And just stream. Just open my door and just fucking stream and say fuck it. And if I'm streaming at weird times, I'm just streaming at weird times. Like I'm trying to fix it to where I'm back to my night shift uh streams, but it's just fucking tough, man. Like right now I feel like I'm about to I'm about to fucking fall asleep in my chair, dude. For no reason. I'm not even like I shouldn't be as tired as I am. Like it's crazy, dude. It's almost like I never go outside and never get vitamin D or something. I don't know. I do I do need uh vitamins and shit though. But it's just been uh I've just been tired, brother. I'm just tired, dude. Like I uh, I it's hard to it's really hard to focus up right now, to be honest. It's really hard to focus up. Like, I just feel like uh, I'm just fucking dead face playing right now. I'm not really, I'm not really getting to fucking enjoy it, you know? So I don't want to, I want to, since we're getting to the last, uh, 
We only have two, I think two bosses left. I wanna, I wanna wait. Get some rest, yeah. I mean, it's not, it's not even that I need rest. I just, my fucking sh sleep schedule is so fucked, man. Like, I probably won't even go to sleep. Like, that's the thing. Like, I'm gonna get off and fucking fall in the room and go to sleep. The boys will probably message me and be like, get on. I'm just gonna fucking stream, though. Like, if I get back on, I'm just gonna fucking stream and say, fuck it, dude. Like, I, I don't even care. But I'm gonna try to get a little bit of sleep. Um, yeah, if the boys get me on, though, I'm gonna take two days off and reset. Dude, I tried that, man. I didn't stream yesterday. It just doesn't fucking work. I'm just gonna fucking stream when I stream, uh, you know. Uh, people will be here. You guys, you guys will get the noties, you know. Every all my noties squad will get it. When we're playing like uh, games like this, I mean, you just if you miss it, you just have to go back and watch it and shit. I, I think like, I think like the way like sometimes like streamers are weird, right? Because we our work schedules are are fucking made up, right? We don't really have work schedules. Yeah, like some streamers like will have four to do four to eight, you know, every day and stuff like that. Like, but for like a gamer, a gamer streamer, like uh, not just uh not just someone that you know, like yeah, I, I mix business and pleasure, right? Like for me, it's not just business; it's also pleasure for me. So like, um, I'll stream some days. I'll stream twelve hours that day, right? And then some days I'll stream four hours. Like today, I have a three, you know four hour stream versus some days a 12 hour streams, you know, and I just go hard and it fuck like that. It just, it whacks your sl uh, sleep schedule up so bad. When you do that, it's impossible to keep a consistent stream schedule when you're like that. If I streamed strictly six hours every day, I got off on that time. The boys didn't hit me up every day. For instance, when I was doing Elden ring, Elden ring is a prime example. When I was doing Elden ring, I was solo play. Every single day. I never played with the with the guys. I only played... Uh, God, this is going to sound terrible. I only played with myself. Um, but no, I only played... I uh, only gamed by myself. So, uh, like, when I got on stream, it was the same time every day. Because I was... You know, it was just me. I didn't have somebody else messaging me. Be like, hey, you want to get on? You want to play? And then playing for eight hours. Because, you know, it's just what you do with your friends. You know, you fucking hang out. You know, and it go, you know, time goes by quicker. So it was, it was a lot easier to keep that consistent uh, schedule. But now now that I'm playing with the guys and I'm streaming, it's just, it's impossible. And I think I, I have to just understand that it's impossible to to keep a consistent stream schedule. Like the way I play games, it's just, it's not possible until we have those those months where we do those solo games. And then we'll have some consistency. But right now, I think we just fucking stream. If I want to stream 16 hours, you know, I'm just going to stream 16 hours. If it's a game that maybe you guys won't enjoy, that's okay. We'll get other people in that do enjoy, you know. It'll be a chance to branch out and uh, get new people in. And I just have to tank those, you know. I, I got to just, you know, you guys will be here when it's a game y'all want to enjoy. And, and it's something, and it's content that y'all are here for. You guys will be here. And some of you guys will be here no matter what. Like, Kevin, you're in here all the time, man. I appreciate you. Brian, you're in here all the time. Dustin. Uh, you guys are always in here, bro. I appreciate you. No matter what game I'm playing, I see you guys, you know? Like, and I do. As a streamer, I see the people that are in here no matter what game I'm playing. I appreciate y'all. Thank you, thank you. But there are some people that are only here for certain games. There will be people that are only here for high on life. I'll never touch the game again. I'll never see some of these people again, you know? And I think, like, as a streamer, I have to get out of that mindset of limiting, like, what you guys get an opportunity to watch me play. Like Tarkov, for instance, when I was learning it and stuff, like, you know, someone yelled at me because I didn't stream Tarkov. You know, they were like, oh, you didn't stream it? Like, I think it was Jed. Jed was like, why didn't you stream it? And, like, to me, I was my first thought was like, oh, Tarkov. No one knows what Tarkov is, first off. If you do know what Tarkov is, you probably don't want to watch me play Tarkov. But that's not always the truth, right? That's not always the truth. So I think, like, I have to just get in the mindset of, like, um, remembering that it's okay to, to just stream games, you know, that not everybody's going to enjoy. People are going to complain. There's always somebody, right, that's like, well, well, you know. Yeah, you know, and and some people are like that, Eric, and I thank you, man. I appreciate you, brother. Thank you. Thank you for just enjoying watching me and enjoying who I am as a person and as a streamer and as we grow together, you know. Like, I thank you for that, Eric. Thank you, thank you. But that's not everybody, you know. Some people just want to watch me play Dark Soul type games, you know. And they're waiting, you know, and they're they're checking in every now and then just waiting on me to jump back on, you know, Elden Ring or something, and, you know, and it could happen one day. You never know. Or an Elden Ring like game. They're just waiting on, you know, like there are people, especially when you're playing with just shut the fuck up, Austin. <laughs> I'm always playing with myself. 
that's the that's the key <laughs> no but uh but no there are there's a i think there's a um I think there's always going to be, you know, different kind of groups of people in in your stream, and I think as a streamer, we we lose sight of that sometimes, and we let numbers and other shit get to us, you know, and like that's why we take these breaks without meaning to, because it's a mental thing. It's, dude, if you think streaming's easy, it's only easy if you're already fucking massive, and all you have to do is get on and and just enjoy yourself. Like uh, starting off streaming is a it's a fucking business. And if anybody's ever, anybody in chat's ever started a business, it's, it's a fucking hit or miss every day. You know, you don't know if it's going to be a good day. You don't know if you're going to have one viewer or if you're going to have 30 viewers that day. You don't know if the game you're playing is going to be the game that, you know, your chat wants you to play, uh, and that you're going to enjoy like that. Cause there's, there's no medium between what you enjoy and what your chat wants you to play. Sometimes it's either that's what it is or that's not what it is. You know, like I, I've fight new you know uh, nell and teeth when i when it comes to like uh when i broke away from elden ring everybody's like yo play elden ring play elden ring and i was like no i want to do this i want to do this you don't want to do this because that's what i wanted to do right and i think a lot of people like just uh a lot of other streamers i've seen streamers drop off you know in the three years i've been doing this i've seen streamers come i've seen streamers go i've seen some succeed and i've seen others fail you know um and it's just what it is like uh, it's part of the market it's a hard fucking market you know and uh, i think uh, men mentally mentally a lot of people can't make it I, i'm obviously i've been doing this for a long time it doesn't bother me as much anymore but uh we do i i think i think even me still now like although i don't see the numbers i don't have the numbers loaded up it's still mentally it's there it's in the back of my head like oh i only have this many people watching today uh, like if I catch a glimpse of the number when I'm looking through, uh, you know, comments and stuff like that, if I if I see the insights or something like that, which I try to close out of because, like I said, it is a mental thing. I, I think like uh, it just it, no matter who you are, it's going to be one of those things. Like if you see your numbers, for instance, for me, I watched my numbers go from 200 to to, to fucking 80 to, to or to 120 to 80 to 40 to 30, you know. Uh, as you know, algo changed, as games changed, as I started playing COD, as I started playing Apex, you know, I watched my numbers go back down to what they were before Elden Ring and stuff like that. Sometimes, obviously, we have a bunch of new faces. Our numbers are never going to be as low as they once were. You know, we're never going to have, you know, uh, we're never going to have a consistent month of three. You know, like uh, we we've had we have our lows, we have our ups, but there's definitely there's definitely still a lot of room for improvement and uh, i think mentally i'm always going to know that you know uh, so i don't know i don't know but you guys are fucking amazing man like i said i i appreciate everybody that hangs out no matter what game i play i want to go ahead and say that one more time you guys are fucking legends i always say this you guys are fucking legends thank you thank you for supporting me as your streamer choosing to be here hanging out with me as we play these games as i'm tired and i'm rambling Thank you for being here, man. You guys are fucking amazing, dude. I really, really appreciate you guys. We're going to go places. Like, I, I've said this, you know, I said this three years ago at the start. We're going to fucking do things. I'm learning. As I go, I adapt. I learn. Some fucking months suck. I, I'm drained. I'm trying to think of what I want to do, uh, what I want to work on, what I, what my next game is, what, like, what's going to be good for, for me mentally. Like, it's not easy. It's not easy. Like, it... If it was easy, everybody would succeed doing this. Everybody would make hundreds of thousand dollars doing this. I'm, I'm just being honest with you guys. And you guys know one thing. I'm fucking always honest, all right? It's not easy being a streamer. It may seem like, oh, all I do is play video games. And I fucking do a lot of times. But the mental taxing shit that goes on... It can be worse than a real job. I honestly, like, I could go back and work, you know, my eight hours a day... And not be mentally as drained as I am sometimes uh, streaming. It's just the reality of it. I know. I did it for 10 years. I streamed part. I streamed more part when I. I, I sh this is actually funny. I streamed more when I was part time than I do now full time. If that says anything. It's mentally exhausting. Like to, to not know what your next day is going to hold. You know it is. It is. And it's okay. It's okay. It's part of the. It's part of the grind. It's part of what you're learning you know. Um, it's some days like, uh, you know, gaming's my job. It's not, you know, sometimes I don't get to have fun doing it, you know, and that's okay. 
It's okay. Uh, it's just part of it. But I love you guys. You guys are fucking legends. I could ramble all night because I'm tired. And that's what we do around here is we fucking ramble when we're tired. But you guys are legends. I want to say that one more time. Thank you. Thank you for supporting me, choosing me as your streamer. You guys are fucking awesome. I love you guys. Um, I, I, sorry, today's a short stream. Like I said, I, I'm just, my fucking sleep schedule has just been shit. I, I can, really can't give you anything more than that. My sleep schedule has just been absolute shit. And there's probably not going to be fixing it. So I'm just going to, I think, I think the best bet is just stream. If that, if that makes it where I'm doing 12 hour streams during the day and not streaming at night for a little bit, that's okay. We're probably going to get into a, a motion where we're doing a lot of night streams, you know? Uh, our sh our schedule just will change periodically and i think that's okay uh, i think you know that'll hit it'll help us hit different crowds and some of you guys may miss stream sometimes uh but you'll be there you know uh, at a different session a different season you know when we're playing a different game that may you know that you guys are, are more in tune with and want to you know catch you know the, you'll make sure that you catch and stuff like that i, I think like as a streamer that's just gonna happen I don't think any any big streamer has a super consistent schedule. I'm going to be honest with you. Like, uh, I think a lot of them do 12-hour streams, 24, 48-hour streams sometimes, and just fucking disappear for a little bit and then just get on at a random time and they're back at it, you know? Uh, and I think that's just the reality of streaming. Like, uh, you're always like uh, you're a face that's always there. And I think that's, uh, that's something that uh, my heart misses sometimes, you know? 